Hello. Oh my God, it is so quiet in the chat. What happened? Where is everybody? Hello, Dr. Sandhill. I don't know if I'm real or not, honestly. Hello, Caliper. Hey, Vlad, it's nice to see you. Hello. You got a Panzerati? I don't even know what that is, but I hope you're enjoying it. Is that like a pizza thing? I don't know. It's true, I am AI. Oh, it's a calzone. Oh my God. Okay, well, enjoy your calzone. I am a VTuber. I'm a PNG tuber, actually. Hello, Asian Grain. How you doing? What's up? CJ, how are you, by the way, BB? Hello, Kalen. Thank you for lurking. Callum, sorry. Cord, hello and dissatisfied. Hi. Howdy. Oh my god, is that a wild Jess? I haven't seen you in so long. How you doing? How you doing? Oh, chat. Chat. I have some... I have some fun news. And that fun news is that I'm streaming again. Second day in a row, baby. I'm a fucking professional streamer. Look at me go. Look at me go. Never before seen. <laughs> Never done in my entire life. <laughs> hey, Pars. Hello. Hello, it's been like 20 years. I want to stop by to let you know your bangs look so great and I'll admire from afar. Thank you, Smiggy. I haven't seen you in a very long time. It's nice to see you, Smiggy. Antoine Bell. Hello. I am good. I hope you are well. And Jez, you have a fever. Is that why you're hanging out here? Honestly, though, I'm not feeling that good either. Um, to be honest, I'm a little sick and I don't know why. My throat is a little ir bit irritated and honestly, I think it's from fucking, uh, fucking. I, th I think it's from fighting Benedicta last night because I kept yelling. So I'm assuming that's what it is. <laughs> oh, listen. Uh-uh, well, look, I usually do take sick days. Um, chat, y'all know. When I get sick, it gets bad, and I'm fighting through it because I want to stream, and also I need to make money, so I don't have an excuse. So what's up? Clipping? Thank you. Clip it and ship it, baby. Your shirt is amazing. Thank you. He is uh, an Emmy nominee, so I had to, I had to fucking bust up the Pedro shirt. <laughs> oh my goodness. How is everybody? Chat, how are we doing? Tell me. Tell me about your day. <gasps> Lax, hello, bestie. How are you? How are you? Congratulations on your retirement. I am so excited for you. This is going to be such a new chapter. What What do you plan on doing? What's the vibe now? Are you going to like, you know, push through content creation? Like, are you going to be like a primary like content creator? What's the sitch? I can't wait to get to a point where I retire, like, from everything, you know? Like, I, I'm able to settle down. I'm excited for that day to come. Thank you. Eight years of nonstop comp. I know. I remember we talked about it one night, and you were telling me that you've been, like, in the game, in the scene, for pretty much your entire, like, adult life, your young adult life, which is absolutely amazing. Congratulations, dude. Content around gaming, cooking, and fitness? Yes! Oh, I'm excited for this. I'm excited for the cooking content! That's exciting, Lex. That's really exciting. It's my day off and I'm watching my favorite person, so I'm great. Thank you, Pars. I'm glad that I am your favorite person. Laxing is just a baby and he gets to retire? Mm-hmm. He busted his ass, so you know what? He deserves it. He deserves it. I mean, look, he's retiring from playing Rainbow Six professionally, but he's not retiring from working. That's the difference. He is still a working man. And honestly, we've all, we're all working men here. <laughs> of course, dude, of course. I gotta support the homies. Hello? Chat, I'm hungry. I'm very hungry, chat. What do I eat? What should I get? Should I get Popeyes? He's just an innocent man. We're just innocent men. Grilled an absolutely mad ribeye today. What is a ribeye? What is that? I'm not a meat person, so I don't know what that is. How games she plays? So Final Fantasy 13, and it's very different. What's 13 about? Make something and take us with. Honestly, I okay. So when I move into my townhouse, the kitchen is gonna be small, but I really want to do like cooking streams. I want to cook Final Fantasy dishes. And like Legend of Zelda dishes. I think that could be a ton of fun. Because I am not a good cook in the slightest. I I am not a good cook. 
but I think it would be really fun to like, you know, try to make try to make a Final Fantasy dish. I think that could be really fun. My uh, my partner loves cooking, and knock on wood, if we're still together at that point, I would love to drag him into some cooking content with me. <laughs> They have cookbooks for a lot of series, Howley. I have a Pokemon cookbook. I'm gonna be getting the Dragon Age cookbook and I wanna get the Final Fantasy cookbook. So like, cooking with a level 90 culinarian. Oh my God. I level up um, culinarian in game and then I, I level up in real life. I do it together. <laughs> That'd be fun. That'd actually be so fun. Please don't make the kind of cooking videos I've been seeing, seeing on Twitter. Bro, I am not molesting my food, okay? Maybe a little bit. <laughs> like, okay, I just like, so here's the thing. That like overly horny cooking content, it is for middle-aged moms who are divorced on Facebook. There, like that content appeals to literally nobody, nobody on this planet except for the divorced white women on Facebook. And good for them. You know, they need content too in this drought of content creation. But like, eh? <laughs> you know? <laughs> it's wild. It's honestly so wild. But I think I will order Popeyes because I saw Pars get incredibly enthusiastic about me getting Popeyes. So, wait, ribeye is a steak or fish? Wait, which one is it? Is it fish or steak? That chicken gonna need to be tenderized. Girl! <laughs> okay, let me open Uber. Waldo went to the vet today, guys. I had to wake up very fucking early to take him because I thought his appointment was at 10, not 9.50. Um, so I took him to his appointment and oh my god, the baby was crying and crying and crying. He does not like the vet, y'all. He does not like it at all. The little anxious boy. And so he got three shots and he got some blood work done and he was giving the vets, oh my God, so much, so much stress. I could hear him like, I was with him for the first bit and he was crying a ton and eventually he calmed down and I gave him lots of pets and like the face scratches really helped. But then when I had to leave him for the blood work, <sighs> the sounds that came out of my dog were like absolute terror. And I felt so bad that I couldn't be with him. But he's okay now. The meds knocked him out. So he's good. I got him some more anxiety medication. So I can like leave him unattended. Or if I'm having friends come over. Like I know he's going to be in check. Um, he's got his tick medication. And like his, like Lyme disease and rabies shots and everything. Um, but I do have some fun news about my dog. Which we all knew. Um, so Waldo's a chunky boy. Um, I thought he was 80 pounds. He is 90 pounds. <laughs> I have a very, very, very healthy, but very fat dog. <laughs> and so the vet told me that I should only give him one meal a day until like autumn, basically. Until like autumn or winter rolls around. Because since he's not like, I mean like on cool days like today, he was playing in the park and he was happy. But it's too hot for him to go on long walks or actually enjoy being at the park. So he's not getting any exercise. So he's just... <laughs> so yeah, so we're uh, we're going to be cutting, uh, cutting back on the snackies for him. Which sucks. I know. I'm sorry, chat. But I got to do what I got to do. So I'm going to get Popeyes, but it's just for me. Cineplex popcorn? No, bitch. I want my Popeyes. I contemplated getting ramen, but I don't want my butt, like, exploding. I don't need that right now. I just ran three miles. I'm on 350 mg of caffeine and got checked up by moms at the playground. Devin, how you feeling? How you feeling? Did the moms like it? Did they like looking at you? Did they like watching your, your booty jiggle while you ran? Tell us about it. Okay. The nuggets with the sweet heat sauce. We're gonna get we're gonna get the good old mashed potatoes chat. And do I get Sprite? Water? No, yeah, I'm getting I'm getting mm, Do I want water? I have water here. I have ginger ale here. I have Coke here. You know what? We're gonna get some Coke because I need some caffeine in my system or else I am going to collapse. Okay, beautiful. 
Oh my god. So I need to look into pet insurance. Um, and I need to write a will uh, ASAP so I can like put Waldo in it and stuff. Um, but chat, I need to look into pet insurance. And if any of y'all know anything about pet insurance, let me know. Because my bill for today was $750. Thankfully, he only has like a like he only goes to the vet once a year, so it's not like too ridiculous. Like seven fifty a year, I can handle that. But like that's seven hundred and fifty fucking dollars, and I am poor. <laughs> Hello, Elijah. Nice to see you again. How are you? Literally, we have water at home. My sister has it for Luna, so I can ask her. Bet. Thank you, Devin. I can ask her if she's a vet tech and lives in Hamilton. Thank you, Kelsey. I definitely will. Poor gang, rise up. Amen. It's not McDonald's Sprite, so no Sprite. True. McDonald's Sprite is like on another like plane, another astral plane. I don't know what they put in their Sprite, but that shit burns. It's like gasoline in the best way possible. I'm making a paper mock-up of Gav's shoulder armor for my cosplay. Ooh, he has a lot more shoulder than me. It's tough to fit it all, fit it all in. Hey, I've heard that one before. Actually, I've said that one before. What? Ken, hello, it's nice to see you. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Nathan, hello. A lot of people have told me I look like a Mexican Pedro Pascal. Well, I'm looking disrespectfully. Say no more. Hello, Frosty Dope. Put up the dog cam so you can work and pay it back. <laughs> oh my god. Imagine if I got Waldo like a little treadmill. <laughs> All my monies goes to Sire in school as it should. Hand it over. Give me the sauce. So apparently they literally take it in special containers rather than stinky bags for the Sprite. What the fuck do you mean? What do you mean by that? Had to do an emergency tooth extraction on my dog after the pet insurance. My wife and I paid around 700 out of pocket after the pet insurance. So what the fuck could that have been before? Do I even want to know? Cammy, hello. It's nice to see you. Oh, you're not very well. Honestly, Elijah, I'm not doing that well either. I was telling chat earlier that I'm like... My lungs aren't really feeling good. Like, I'm having trouble. Well, actually, I don't know if I told chat this, but I, I tweeted it um, on my alt account. I, I My lungs are hurting. Oh, I did actually tell chat. Uh, my lungs are hurting. Um, so my throat's hurting and everything. And I think it's because I was yelling a lot while I was fighting Benedicta yesterday um, on stream. So my body has been kind of hurting, too. Like, everything is like, it feels like I have a chest cold. And I am used to this feeling because when I stream, it, it happens pretty frequently. Like, it's not foreign to me, but, you know. If Sarah ain't getting ramen, I am. Get get spicy chicken ramen in my honor. In my honor, CJ. I remember having to use care credit for pet bills. Because LOL, what's pet insurance? Back then, I was lucky if I had my own insurance. I'm. Pr it's probably different um, in the US versus Canada. I mean, everything, you know, health related and whatnot is very different between our countries. Even though we're both like NA, you know. McDonald's is very particular about their fountain drinks. The entire syrup chain is kept at low, very low temperature and they use less syrup than most places. Why? But the more syrup, the sweeter. So what? Oh, you're getting Chinese food? What are you getting? Oh, I could fuck up some fried rice right now. I could really fuck up some fried rice. I think I still have gyoza left. Oh, okay, chat. I am now regretting not getting ramen. I'm regarding not getting ramen, not getting gyozas, not getting fucking dumplings, not getting like chicken fried rice. Ugh. Ugh. I own an insurance agency, but I'm in Maryland, so probably not gonna be help other than general info. I would try the company Pets Best. I think they're everywhere and easy to check into online. Okay, I'm gonna send that to myself. Pets Best. Okay, thank you. I will check that out. Maybe it'll do wonders for me and my dog. Only 26 Weeball. Sarah, what does the title mean? I would risk it all for Torgal. Torgal is the dog companion in Final Fantasy 16. He is Clive's best friend. And he almost died last night on stream. That fucked me up. That really, really fucked me up. I for sure thought that our dog died. And I've been scared this whole time during this entire playthrough that my dog was going to die. And so we're fighting the boss. And then at one point, like when she, I think it was before she switches to her uh, second second phase. Um, she fucks up my dog. And 
he's alive, thankfully, but I was scared. I was scared. I'm gonna keep stream running, but go lay down. Have hope you have fun, Sarah. Thank you, Elijah. I appreciate you lurking. Take care. I'm glad I played a bit before I started watching her. I'm glad you did too, because that means you can hang out here. I just air fry some chicken nuggets. Ooh, I have never used an air fryer before. I don't actually know like how it works, but I upgraded my appliances in my townhouse. Um, it's cost me like $3,000 for the upgrade, but whatever. Um, and now my oven and my microwave have built an air fryers. So I'm excited to fuck it up. <laughs> I'll let you know when Topaz gets back to me. She has two beagles that she has insurance for. Okay, thank you, Kelsey. It is once again barking hours. Thank you for barking for me, Dink Spoons. I appreciate it. You know I love a good barker. I get very offended when people don't bark under my photos, honestly. I know what I look like. I know what I'm capable of. And you're not barking? What is this? What do you think this is? Askron, hello, how are you? Oh, you're halfway through the game, CJ? Damn. Okay, so yeah, I'm taking my sweet time. So by the time you finish the game, I'll be where you are right now. I'm not barking? Coward. Oh, so you got air fryer money, but not vet money? Yeah. Literally, yeah. Well, here's the thing. The reason why I have air fryer money and not vet money is because I had the townhouse meeting, like, when was it? A couple weeks ago? And look at it this way, all right? Listen, chat. Let me, let me teach you. Let me teach you a little something, something, okay? The investments that I'm putting into this townhouse, I have already done $50,000 worth of upgrades, which is killing my fucking bank account. But that $50,000 already raises the value of my property by at least 100 to 200K. That's how that works. I have put good money into high quality appliances, high quality like furnishing and everything. Which means when I am ready to resell my property, it's just going to fucking, it's going to skyrocket. So you know what? It's worth it. It hurts right now. And like life is a little bit, a little bit tricky right now in terms of like, you know, you know, groceries and shit like that. But in the long run, yeah, it's going to benefit me so much. And honestly... It's better that like I upgrade through the company that I'm working with than upgrade on my own because then I won't have to remove the appliances myself, go and buy them myself, get someone to help me install them. They will do it for me as the property is being built. You know what I mean? So it's like, I'm kind of getting more bang for my buck that way. You may not have food, but at least we're going to Fall Out Boy. I am so excited, Devin. I cannot wait for you to come to Toronto and for us to go see Fall Out Boy together. I can't believe I'm seeing BMTH and Fall Out Boy, and then the next day I'm seeing 50 Cent, Busta Rhymes, and fucking Jeremiah. Like, wild. Wild. BRB, you gonna go to McDonald's to get some Sprite? As you should, Gandhi, as you should. Yeah, bro, I'm going to see 50 Cent. I'm going to the 50 Cent concert. I'm excited, I'm very excited. I got the game right when I started vacation, so I was running to play it because depression. Okay, very relatable. Depression is what fuels me. But what about Torgo's wrestling throw from Benedictus Throat? Oh my god, it was amazing, Ken. I was fucking, I was rooting for Torgo. Torgo had my back. <laughs> I'm going to be in Seattle in two months for Coldplay. Ooh, fun! Da -na 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 Man, I remember when Coldplay was like popping off in Canada back in the day. You've never been to a concert here. I'll give you a free show right now. Um, I can show you the world. Shining, shimmering, splendid. Tell me, uh, dang spoons. Now when did you... Last, let your heart decide. <laughs> I can open your eyes. Take you under. Not the lurk. Not the lurk. Not the mute. No, not this. <laughs> Come back. I give you guys a free fucking show and this is how you treat me? This is how you treat your streamer? Nah, I'll remember this chat. 
I'll remember this. I know where I stand with you all, and honestly, I'm a little hurt. I do be a little hurt. Hey, I'm dancing, and you fucking better be. Yes! Good content! Burr, 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 burr. Burr, burr. I don't know if we have to blame my singing or we have to blame my barking. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit. Ow, my finger! Oh fuck. Oh shit. Ooh, I don't know how I'm gonna fix this. Oh chat, it's busted bad. Oh chat, I fucked it up. Oh, chat, it's bad. Oh, I can't fix this. Vlad! 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 <laughs> um. Okay, um. Okay, um. My mic is really heavy. I don't know. Okay. Okay, chat. I, I, um, I, um, okay. We have to make a makeshift stand now, chat. Okay. Okay, no, I would show you what I'm doing, but I would dox myself in the process because of the window. So we're actually not gonna do that. Um, oh God. Okay. Um, I'm gonna put this statue here and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh God. Um, Oh boy. Uh, okay, how does this work? Okay, so it snaps in. Okay. I don't know if I can snap it in though. Chat, this is, um, so, uh, how's everyone doing? Need me to come over and fix it, Vlad? Honestly? Chat, can, can you all yell at Vlad to come, <laughs> to come fix this? <laughs> can you bend and snap? Bend and snap! Wait, how do you do it again? Oh, it's like, it's, it's bend and snap. I, I've seen Legally Blonde. Oh my God. Okay, wait. Chat. Okay, hold on. I, I may have gotten it. No, I haven't. Um, okay. Chat, I'm putting you all down. That's why I need pet insurance. Cause you're all getting put down. <laughs> Okay, hold on. What is this? What am I getting a text from? Who is this? Who's texting me? That is it you? No, it's not. It's a fucking advertisement. Okay. Okay, let's see how this works. Oh, it broke! Oh no, it fully broke. That's what happened. Oh, this thing like actually broke. You see that? It like fully snapped. You know how fucking expensive the road boom mic things are? Boom boom arm uh, mic a boom 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 ba boom boom. You know how fucking expensive these are? And I was just fuck I was just fucking complaining about finances. Who smited me? Who smote me? Who? Who? Okay. Wait, you can't hear me? You can't hear- Hello? Oh. Okay. Okay, Chad. Okay. Okay, we're gonna- We got this. We got this. I'm putting the mic- Oh my god, what fell? Oh my god. What is falling? What fell? What fell? I don't even know what fell. Okay. Okay. Chat, can you hear me? You're on the window. Chat, you've, you, you, you've, you're on the window. <laughs> Chat, you're, yeah, you're on the window. Um, 
this this is this is weird because you guys are all the way over here to the window to the wall to the sweat dropping down my balls or whatever the fuck the lyrics are H, how you doing? Hello. Ramu did it? No, for real. Sid? Sid? Okay. Well, on that beautiful note, um, <laughs> how does the audio sound? How, how are we sounding, chat? Are we sounding okay? Are we sounding good? Is my audio fine? We're gonna, we're gonna, let's, let's just get into the video game, shall we? I'm a bit low. That's cause I'm so far away. It's cause I'm so far away. Clearly audible though. Nice mic. Thank you. This might cost me also a fortune. So I would hope I would hope <laughs> Okay, okay Okay chat, um, let's do some readjustments then See that's where my mic is see how far it is now um How do, you know what I'm just gonna you're gonna hear actually no you're not gonna hear double audio I'm gonna mute the- I'm gonna mute this. I'm gonna open up the stream real quick and I'm just gonna see how I sound. Give me a second. What's pumping? This fucking bussy. How are you, Femme Fatality? We just broke my mic. Chat broke my mic. It was definitely not because I was barking. Okay, let's see how- Okay. This isn't- This isn't too bad. She snaps! Thank you for the raid! Hello, hello! Hello, hello, hello. My name is Sarah. I am a Final Fantasy XIV streamer, and currently we are playing Final Fantasy XVI, and I just broke my mic. So, we are having a little bit of complications right now, but we will make it work, my friends, I promise. Sorry you were barking, but the mic was not your fault. I was not barking, and the mic was definitely not my fault. It was chat's fault, because they were barking. <laughs> Yeah, the shout out command for some reason like doesn't work properly. I I know there's another way to shout out streamers, but I I I don't know how to do it. So figure it out, figure it out, mods. But yes, hello, hello, loud packed. How are you? Or loud pack pat? Let me play Pokemon on the first Game Boy No Color. Goodness, no no color, no color. You mean the Game Boy Color? I played Pokemon. What do you call it? Uh, Pokemon Gold. That was my shit. I just came in here because I know I follow you elsewhere, but hadn't seen your streams yet. Love the Twitter energy. Thank you, she snaps. It's very sweet of you to say. Thank you. I'm glad that people enjoy the uh, hellish content that I produce for Twitter because you can't get there. You can't get that anywhere else. I've spent like the last month on Twitter just being like, wow, men are trash. <laughs> And not even because, like, I want to, but, like, I feel like Twitter these last few days has, or last few weeks has just been, like, a nightmare. Typhlosion gang, baby! Yes, Typhlosion is best boy. Final Fantasy 16 is so action-packed. Local front page stri Twitch streamers are spooks. Broke her arm while playing it. Yes, I broke my arm. It's true. Facts. I know, Elon Musk has literally ruined Twitter. I was thinking about this the other day, and chat, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but I have not seen Twitter have this many bugs and n mandatory updates in my entire, like, career on Twitter. Twitter has never been this, like, dog shit before. Finally putting a voice to those tweets after all this time. Hello, Omar! Welcome! Also, Radium Skull, welcome as well. Oh, welcome, everyone else that's new. Welcome, 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 welcome. But yeah, this is my voice. I've been told many times that my voice doesn't match my face, um, and that people don't expect me to sound like this, and then it raises the question of, like, what the fuck did you expect me to sound like? Like, what, what was I supposed to sound like, you know? Then you are Pascal. Isn't he beautiful? <laughs> it was massively influential in my career for so long, and now it's just dead. 
Like, there's still some shit happening there, but it's su it's just such a big bummer. It is. And that's the thing with Twitter and social media in general for content creators. It doesn't matter if the platform sucks, you have to utilize it. And I really need to, like, start putting that energy towards um, platforms like TikTok because, oh my god, lord knows I do not fucking use that platform. He fired all the best engineers. He fired all the best en engineers. They got hired by Mark Zuckerberg and now he's crying about it. Like... They needed a job, Bestie. Maybe you shouldn't have fired them. I like that way. I like the way you are, but Pepper is better. Hello, Stevie Mick... Mick Sphincter. Hello. Are we drinking Elon tears? We're always drinking his tears. Always. Besides all the bugs, we also have blue check reply guy weirdos at the top of the replies. Those are always the worst comments you've ever heard bubble up, I know. And that's why, like, I don't look at my replies really anymore because I just... People are mean, and it doesn't get to me. Um, like, they don't upset me, but I always want to clap back, and then it gets worse. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, my tweet may go viral, but, like, then more incels are gonna attack me, and it's like, do I really need that right now, you know? BRB making a vodka called Elon Tears? Yo! Doing shots with that. My Popeyes will be here soon. Imagine thinking Margot Robbie is mid. I know. Men are so fucking delusional. And obviously, I don't mean all men. But somehow, always a man. Like, how could you look at Margot Robbie and call her mid? Bro, a woman like that wouldn't breathe anywhere near you if she had the choice not to. Like, Cammy! Cammy, thank you for the $50 donation! That is going towards both my Popeyes and Waldo's vet bills. Thank you! Thank you so much! Can we get some hype in the chat for Cammy, please? Let's get some come in hype or some Syra Wiggles. Gotta run, but glad to hang and talk shit for a hot second. Keep doing your thing. Bye, she snapped. It was really nice meeting you. Hope to see you again. Hello, granddad. People actually think that? Yeah, it, I don't... I, here's the thing. I don't know if people actually think that. Um, There's like... I think, I think I read this. It's called like a theory called the sour grape theory or sour grape effect or whatever. Um, The story is that a fox wanted to eat grapes... But the fox couldn't jump up and catch the grapes or grab the grapes. And so they said, well, they probably suck anyways. And so it's that like that like theory or whatever that people dislike what they can't attain because it makes them feel better about themselves. And that is very true. Also, is this lagging? I feel like I feel like this is lagging. I think I need to reboot my my PlayStation. Oh, it is. It is lagging. Sorry, chat. Give me one sec. I just need to make sure that my game is gaming. Okay, return to title. Oh, do I not have any? There we go. Okay, cool. Okay, return to title. And then let's just turn this off completely. If I can. If I can. Can I not just hold that button and fucking turn it off? Okay, we'll just do it this way. Into rest mode! I didn't want rest mo- uh, whatever. Margot Robbie is the ideal. When did this change for literally anyone? I couldn't tell you. Okay, yeah, now it's not lagging. Beautiful. I genuinely couldn't tell you. Look, and the quality just got so much better. Is that all it took? Look, look at this! I don't understand. Amazing. Amazing. Um. Uh, but yeah, no, Margot Robbie is beautiful, and I'm really, really, really tired of the world's ugliest men who, like, crawl out from underneath a rock covered in filth they need to shower they smell like ass and they go on social media and then they bully beautiful women and it's like we obviously shouldn't let these people get to us but they are they go into such 
detail. They go into such detail about it, and that's the part that's really infuriating. I had, when the stuff with um, uh, Ian Miles Chong and, and Tristan Tate was happening, there was a man um, who was basically trying to rip me apart, calling me ugly in, in, in every fashion possible, and then proceeded to tweet about how he wanted to rape me and in all the different ways that he would do so and was just announcing things that like he thought that I needed like oh yeah she looks like she needs da 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 and it's the stuff like that that is like fucking vile and it, exactly it's always a man not all men but somehow always a man and I hate it. So if I see an ugly ass dude on Twitter talking shit about beautiful women, I will rip them apart. Because they, they, they who are you? Who, like, if you had friends, if you had a life, if you had a spouse, you would not be on Twitter spewing this shit. And if your spouse was even remotely aware of any of this shit, they would fucking leave you. Oh, starting screen is, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, how's the audio now? Does it sound better? You're 10 quests away from finishing Endwalker? Oh my god, Larry, I'm excited for you. I'm like 100 quests away. Wouldn't you rather step away from all that? What, roasting men? No. Okay. My Popeye should be here in a second, so I'm gonna wait for it before we uh, load into this. People lash out and throw tantrums because they can't get something exactly. And I understand, like, jealousy is a bitch. We all yell at our friends. We all vent to our therapists. I get it. But if you go out of your way to bully people on the internet that you don't know, like, come on. Come on. The horrors really are unending on Twitter. Good thing I don't look at shit on Twitter other than memes and cute pets. Honestly, I don't look at anything else either. If you look at my alt Twitter, it is literally all like cute animals, down horrendous memes. Like it's just goofy ass shit. But the only time I encounter garbage is when other people put it on my timeline on my main Twitter and that's when I see it. Or I just post a selfie and they come crawling. Did you get some popcorn shrimp for chat? No, I did not because you all broke my mic. <laughs> Everyone wants to feel important. My dad is doing literally all inexplicable human beha behavior. And it's true. Everyone does want to feel important. Everyone does want to feel loved. But tearing down others is not going to get you there. Okay, I'm going to put a... Okay, I'm opening my throne wish list. And y'all do not have to do this, but I'm going to put... A, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the, uh, the boom mic thingy on my, on my, uh, wish list. Because, if there is a god out there, then maybe I can be saved from paying a hundred and thirty dollars. You last purchased this item on May 10th, 2019. This has lasted me four years. Good fucking job. Good job. Slay. Honestly, truly, slay. Okay. Will bark for popcorn shrimp? I ordered chicken nuggies. I'm so sorry that you have to find out this way, but there is no popcorn shrimp. I'm actually not a shrimp gal. I don't like seafood, period. But I fuck with calamari. If there's like a good dip with it, then I'm happy. Dentist Sturdum has entered the chat, my boy. Number one simp. That's my boy. Actually, while I'm here, I am gonna edit my um I wish I'm just gonna delete some things really quickly.
so much Waldo stuff and stuff for me. Okay, beautiful. Oh my god, dentist! Hello! You're actually here! That's so jokes. There's no way Kelsey literally just summoned you. Some people think they're the center of the universe and will listen to anyone else. Yeah, that's me, actually. I do think I'm the center of the universe. Actually, I, I firmly believe it. I know it. Um... Can you text me that? Please and thank you if you do not mind. Okay, my Coca-Cola just flipped, so remind me not to open it. Let's see how long it takes for her to notice what I did. What did he do? What did he do? What did he do? What did he fucking do? What did this idiot do? Dentist, what did you fucking do? Did he do it? <laughs> Did he buy it? chat and I sang really terribly and then I started barking and then my uh, my mic stand broke it literally like broke broke um <laughs> and so my mic is being propped up basically against the the window and a box my black wall statue from um uh Bioware <laughs> and so <laughs> Yeah, the mic was like, yeah, I don't want any part of this. I missed that. You did. You did. <laughs> you did, bestie. And the mic said, nah, fuck this shit. I'm out. We, we got a baby in here. Waldo, I'm going to tease you with this because I can't give you any. But little baby. Maybe the little baby. See, this is the boy who cost me $750 today at the vet. Because he needed his his little his little uh, checkup. Okay. <sighs> Literally dropped the mic. Mic drop. Okay. So we're gonna get into the game in a second. I just want to have a couple nuggets first, and then we'll uh, and then we'll start. I guess I could technically just like have it open. Omni, how you doing? It's nice to see you. Always a nice, positive face to see in my chat. Mm. Mm. Hi, Avalon. You can post a link somewhere, and I can um, I can swap it out on my wish list. Sire and Waldo, the most wholesome couple. Damn right. Foyinski, how are you? It's nice to see you, Foyin. Another lovely face I love seeing in my chat. The mic arm, that mic arm means I can't give subs so I can have money for Koopacon. Honestly, that's okay. I appreciate you replacing my, my arm. My robo arm, dentist. You don't need to give subs. It's okay. As much as we love bullying you and taking your money, 
<laughs> it's okay. Hmm. Ava, that's a good place to, po to post it. Please do. Thank you for seeing the old one to Oblivion. No, thank you. Thank you. Ooh, I don't know, Kelsey. Tiff is going, right? Ooh, maybe my friend Oz will go. Just hit my vape. I'm ready for Sire to game like she has never game before. Hell yeah! Isn't it kind of funny that every time I play a game, it literally is like the first time I've ever played a game? Like... I forget commands so quickly. It's kind of embarrassing. What you eating? Popeyes chicken nuggets. Aww. Just having a quick bite before <clears throat> we get deeper into the game. Because I know once we start, I'm not going to be able to eat. I'm gonna have Clive in my room. Tuck's hair behind ear, Kelsey. I'm supposed to be going out for drinks with him, but we'll see how that goes. Oh. Oh. Streetwise, how you doing? How are you? You know what's like a weird thing that I like to do? With the mashed potatoes from Popeyes, I like to dip the biscuit in it. I eat it like that. I know a lot of people use honey, but I like the gravy and the potatoes. Hmm. There's forgetting commands, and then there's self-inflicted change the control scheme, and then having to learn it. Mm hmm I think that's what was so funny. I changed my control, my controller stuff, right before really pivotal con <clears throat> combat moments in game. So that was such a struggle to like get accustomed to. Will the tickets sell quick for it? Probably, Helly. I would advise just being, like, trying to be a patron. It only costs, like, I think seven bucks, which, like, honestly, not that bad. And then you can unsub once you buy your ticket. Control type D, amen. D's only in this house. I guess you could say he's nuts. I'm glad 16 has put Ben Star in the spotlight. His work in this game is phenomenal. His voice acting is very, very good. I'm excited to see more of his range as the uh, narrative progresses. I didn't even realize he was following me on Twitter until like, I think like a couple months ago. I was like, why is this dude following me? Who is this dude? Oh, he's cute. Oh, he's a voice actor. Who is- who, what's he doing? <laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I'll need to reach up in December? Okay. That's fine. Do what you gotta do, you know? <clears throat> now I want chicken? Go get some chicken! I'm having a hard time. Gav has so many accessories on his belt, so I have to study screenshots of his ass. What is wrong with studying screenshots of his ass, though? That is a gift. You tell me you don't want to stare at Gab's ass? What? Okay. Hello, Blue Meow. Now I'm craving fried chicken at 2 a.m. 2:30 a.m. You're welcome. Honestly. I get most of my like fried chicken and like burger cravings at like midnight, so that sounds, you know, normal to me. Mm. I'm good, Blue Meow. I'm good. 
Just eating some nummies while I get ready to play some Final Fantasy 16. Hmm. My, um, my mic stand broke. The arm for my mic broke. And so, if I sound a little bit distant, it's because it's propped up against a window. And I'm having to project more than usual. So, one of those days. Hmm. Okay, I think I'm about done eating these nuggies. I have seven left, or eight left. So I've only had four. But that's a lot for me, because I'm baby. I can't believe she broke the mic arm barking at us. Um, fake news. <laughs> Hmm. Okay. 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 Are you ready? Chat, are we ready to get back into the game? I have no idea what's coming up. We just got Garuda's powers now. So now we're gonna learn how to use those. Those iconic abilities. It's an icon. Oh! And Benedicta has completely transformed into Garuda. I think I have to go fight her again or something. I'm gonna watch the VOD so I can meme the mic break. I could always count on you. Oh, you know, I said I was ready to start playing, but now I'm just eating the mashed potatoes. What are the odds that this is gonna give me an upset stomach? Pretty high, right? Oh, but it's so good. Oh, but it's so good, chat. Mm. I love fast food, but it does not love me. I will never forget when I was playing Stormblood and I had Indian food and then was stuck on the toilet for 30 minutes and then it booted me from the instant that I was in. That killed my soul. I have Tums. I should be fine. Now we continue our quest for bird milk! No! She's ready to game, ready to rumble. I am ready to rumble, baby. Okay, okay, okay. I can't keep eating these potatoes. I'm gonna eat all of them. Oh my god, chat. Mm. I have some vegan nuggets I cook in the air fryer. Ooh. Honestly, Beyond Meat actually fucks. Like, if it's, like, seasoned right. I'm a big... I, I love tofu. I love, 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 like, bacon and shit. Um, and I think it's underrated. The meat industry sucks, I say, as I eat chicken nuggets. Um, and so whenever I do get the option to, I almost always opt out for, like, a vegan meal, you know? My friends kind of bully me sometimes because we'll go to like a really fancy restaurant and I'm out here like ordering a salad. I mean, I don't know. If I have the option to go the veggie route, I will. Oh, you make chicken nuggets from scratch? How do you prep that? Do you just like beat the meat and then bread it? Do you beat your meat and then put it in the air fryer? Is that how that works? Oh, chat, this was a bad idea. Oh my god, I couldn't put it down. I wasn't even hungry. Oh, beauty, hello! Hello, hello. Have you tried Greek salad? It does have lettuce. Greek salads do have lettuce. It's got like olives, feta, lettuce. 
Or am I crazy? And like tomatoes and red onions. Oh. Okay, chat. Okay. Putting it away. Sometimes you just gotta go full dog mode and eat it all like you won't eat tomorrow. Exactly. Holy shit. I'm gonna go into a fucking food coma. And before we get into the game, let me just show you this good boy who is being so patient even though he's getting nothing. Oh my baby. Oh my bubba. Oh, the meds still got him so sleepy. Look at him. He's literally that emote. He's literally that emote right now. I love you. I love you. Uh, love you. This dog is literally my pride and joy. I would do anything for him. Sometimes I can't believe that I have a dog. Do you ever like look at animals and just go, oh my god, you have a pulse. Like you are a real thing. You're not a toy. Like, I have to take care of this thing, you know? Like, every day, I have to take care of this dog. I have to make sure that he's fed. I have to make sure that he, he's got his water. All of that stuff. Otherwise, he dies. Like, it's my responsibility. That's so wild. Hey, baby boy. Alright. Okay, we ready? It feels really weird having my mic all the way there. Oh my god. Okay, make for the eye of the tempest. Right, and they're all the little Garudas here, right? Oh man, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna... We're gonna go up here. We're gonna get this item, and we're gonna fight this one right over here. You know what to do, boy. Oh, I meant to dodge that. My bad. Oh, my ass. Okay, okay. Huh? I already forgot how to play. No, I got this, I got this. potion. I have nothing else now. God damn. Do I get items from killing these? Like, is it like a worthy farm? Probably nothing that'll be like a boost to me. God, that was terrible. Oi! What the fuck? Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Okay, so a clouded eye. Okay, so I do get like some mats for uh, for killing them. Okay, definitely nothing that I I think I I, I need. A whopping two gill <gasps> potion. Nice quest destination nearby. Good stuff. <gasps> nice. But Clive is so pretty. That's baby girl right there. He's in there. Yeah, the uncontrolled tornado that Garuda created. Third World Prime, hello! Welcome to the chat, how are you? I like how your dog has a big smile. He's a very happy boy. How often are you supposed to walk a dog? Uh, depends on the breed and depends on the walks. Um, normally I take Waldo on two, usually two very long ones a day, but because he doesn't like going on walks, I take him on about three a day. Um, because it's really hot out. A little too hot for him, you know? Do you want me to tag you in the Discord or mind you check later? Yes, please, uh, uh, Avalon, if that's all right. Love how he was just sitting off camera vibe, and he does that. He likes to hang out. 
You know what? You're gonna have something you can barely afford and you'll be happy for those two gil you found? You're right! No, you're right. You're right, dentist. You know what? Every gill counts. All right, the Eye of the Tempest. Born of the darkness buried deep within a broken Lady Benedicta, the Eye of the Tempest is an uncontrollable vortex of immense proportion fed solely by Garuda's raw fury. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Am I sitting okay? Am I, like, sitting properly? I don't know. Do I look okay? Okay. <laughs> Oh, look at Clive's little waist. I just want to grab him. There he is. Oh yeah! That's why. Oh yeah! Okay. What's that? The dominant. Yeah, 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 yeah. The man who killed my brother. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Yeah, 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 For the past 13 years. That's him. That's fucking him. flames of his eye contact, Joshua. Fucking kicks him out the way. Actually iconic. Thank God. Don't worry about us. What? We waited for this. Go! Sit! Am I gonna have to go take down this man on my own? This fucking Asahi assian ass looking- Oh my god. Okay, we got this. We got this. What could go wrong? What could possibly go wrong, chat? Nothing. Oh, am I like actually gonna chase him? Awakening. Here we go, here we go, here we go. And he's gone. Yep. Where did he go? I don't know, baby. Oh, there he is. I see him. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Mommy Garuda! Oh my god! I'm cranking up the volume for this. Okay. We about to get yelly chat. Okay, I see him. He's all the way up there. Come on, come on. The tree! Ah! <laughs> She's toying with me. She she absolutely is, and I love it. I love it. This rendition of Garuda is so fucking hot. Come on, Clive, you got this, you got this. Push through this vortex, you got this. Okay, we're gonna go up this way. Come on. Oh! Never mind. I guess we're not going up that way. No, we are. We are still going up this way. Come on. There you go, there you go. Okay, we're gonna ooh. Oh, he's up there, he's up there, he's up there. God, everything is collapsing. I found you. You called me! Why? Oh shit, oh god, oh god, ah! <laughs> oh my, mommy! Ooh. God, she's huge! Oh my god! That is mother, that is mother, oh my god! right now though yeah. oh! let's go Clive let's go oh, there 
she's, she's got a thong on. She's got a thong. Ooh. Takedown! Sick. But again, wait, I'm coming around. I'm coming around. Oh, no, she keeps turning. I'm trying to see that booty. What the? Oh, no, 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 touched me <sighs> oh fuck oh no oh no i've lost my momentum you know what i'm gonna stick with the fire shit i like it better What now? What now? What now? What now? Ooh, what's she doing? What's she doing? Zoom in on the boobs? Oh, what's she, what's she doing? What the fuck is this? Is an arrow blast? <sighs> Literally aerial blast. I'm so smart. I can't hear her screaming. Oh, fuck. Okay. 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 Ooh. 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 Should I get, like, close to her for this? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I think I can really... I think I just have to keep dodging them. <laughs> Dude, her cheeks jiggle! Her cheeks jiggle! So fucked. And if I die, it's fine because I get my potions back, right? Oh, did I mess? Oh, I did. oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. We're fucked. We're fucked. I'm just gonna die here. Yep. Oh, bro. She's so sick. I have fought Garuda like three times now. Or I guess like Benedicta, right? Oh, this is so fucking cool. This is so cool. They're like, you thought you were done with her? Nah, nah, we're only, we're just starting, bro. Why is she on her knees though? That's what I wanna know.
not do anything? Okay, I think it did. triumphant this music is. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome back to the Coven of Drew Badgemos and your stay. Look, listen, there's nothing I love more than jiggle physics, okay? Even if they don't make sense. I'm a simple woman. I'm very simple. She's leaning down trying to see you like, ha, Clav, how are you so tiny? Don't kill me. Look at this tiny mortal. <laughs> there she goes. The tornado should subside now too then, huh? So where'd the dominant go? Fuck. Oh! No shot! You're nothing. There's no shot! She's regenerating! I will not. Do you think the Asian looking Fandania looking dude? It's gonna come in. Oh? He's got Ephraim in him. I'm fucking telling you, he's got Ephraim in him. from hot to literally hot. Oh my god, do I get a- Oh! 
Do I gotta fuck her up? That's oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's icon versus icon. Oh my Ah <laughs> Melee attack, range attack, evade. Cool. Iconic lunge. Uh, R1 can be used to charge an enemy, covering great distances in a short period of time, as well as dealing damage if the enemy is struck. All abilities available on body if it can be confined confirmed on the abilities have in the main menu. Sick. Okay, let me just fix my lips. Do I look good for Clive now? Yeah? Okay. Let's fucking go! <laughs> this is sick! This is sick! This is sick! Oh, Jesus. Oh my god! <laughs> my abilities. Oh hell nah! Oh hell nah! Ooh, got the feet, got the feet! Clive growling? Oh, I'm pretty. Okay, my bad. Wait, I want an alt. Oh, nah. This is so cool. This is so cool. This is literally so fucking sick. HP though. <laughs> We're like neck and neck right now. It's the sky full and it crawl. Why can she do cool things? I want to do cool things too. Heat it up, heat it up, heat it up. Meteorite, meteorite, heat it up, heat it up, heat it up. Heat it up, heat it up, heat it up. Come on, launch it out like a fucking meteor. Let's go. Oh, okay. Ooh, ooh. That works too. Is there, was there even a way for me to, to dodge that? I can like combat her abilities with my fireballs. That's kind of sick. I mean, she can combat mine too, though. That took a lot of damage out of me because I went through the tornado. Fuck. Oh, grab her, grab her, grab her, drag her. Oh, beauty. I'm trying to die. Fuck me. Grab her again. Ah! Dude, her thighs! Can't you just like grab her by her like bird bussy? Like, does she have one? Ooh. Me and my shield. It's kinda not really, no. I'm just zooming, I'm zooming. Oh my god, okay, so it was me that like it was me that fought Joshua in the beginning then, right? Unless there are two two Ifrit summons? 
Be dom dominance? I don't fucking know. Because on God, that was Efrit that fucked up. Joshua, no? no? I don't know. Maybe now's not the time for me to question this? Ooh. My arm! Oh, but this shit regens. This is gonna- it's gonna regen. I'm gonna be fine. Oh, no. Oh my god, these shots! Oh my god! How is she strong enough to carry me like that? Yeah, look at me in my arm. I'm just like watching our HPs. Like, I only have a smidgen less than her. Ooh, ooh. This is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, get fucking burned. Oh, oh, oh. We're still good. She's still good. Come on. 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 Burn to a crisp. To a crisp. Turn her into my Popeye's chicken nuggets! Fucking eating her for dinner. Oh! I'm hot. Stop this now. Is he gonna go all remove on us? Get zapped. <laughs> Amazing. Okay. What the blood? You can't keep doing this, man. Said this is gonna Too kill nice you. Yeah, my problem too. Being nice only kills you. Bloody mess, this. It only hurts you. Time to be me. I'm 
surprised Clive still has his clothes. Like, turning into the, like, icons doesn't rid you of your clothes. How does that make sense? The ghost you've been chasing. Mm-hmm. Was inside you all along. Yep. Yep. I knew it. I fucking knew it. I'll be damned if I know what that means. Oh, that's hers. I'm gonna try to find the body. He just found it. Aww. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Aww. Sorry, this is supposed to be like a tender scene. <laughs> to listen to him. Mm. Regular. This can't be what you wanted, can it? She looks way more intact than I anticipated, honestly. Maybe that's for the best. Nice. Titty shot at the end of this chapter. <laughs> Sometime later. Odin! King is bold, but desperate. Will you engage him personally? Who is this? Who is Prince Charming over here? He's a dragoon. Grigor's breath fill your wings. Oh 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 oh! Just like that. We form the cohorts. At what? Their attacks are frequent and widespread, even in the holy capital. The capital? What of my father? His is radiance he... is safe. But he has 
ordered the city guards strengthened. We can expect no reinforcements. It is of no matter. The Emperor's safety is paramount. I shall deal with our enemies here. He's so pretty. I can't stop thinking about how pretty this man is. So fucking cool. <gasps> is that Clive, you are naked and wet without me? <laughs> Yep, I fucking called it. I fucking called it. I knew it. I knew it! Oh my god. Oh, the trauma! Ah, you're awake. You're just full of surprises. First that trick with Garuda, then whatever the hell that other thing was. Didn't know you had it in you. Maybe. Do it. Hey. Kill me. <laughs> it was me. I killed him. I killed Joshua. I killed them all. I'm a monster. And I deserve to die. So end it. End it. <laughs> Please! Please! Ah! One big slap, yeah. <laughs> I reckon I can take you, if that's what you want. But first, I thought I'd give you... He is butt-ass naked, ain't he? Oh my god, he is. Oh my god. Camera angles, please. It seems to me, you see, that since you're still breathing, you might as well make yourself useful. Get dressed. Pretty as you are, you're not my type. <laughs> I'll uh, see you in the hall. <laughs> Sid is a fucking icon! Literally. Actually. And figuratively. <laughs> it's okay, he's my type. I'll take him, Sid. I got you. I got it from here. <laughs> okay, princess. Let's go. What are you going to do now? Oh, it's the end of the cutscene. I was just pulling out a nugget. The wages of guilt. Mm. 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 Ah! Oh, I'm gonna. Okay, so. Clive laying naked, wet, and panting on the ground is not something I expected to see in this game, but I'm grateful. For once, it feels like Yoshi P was listening to me, and specifically me. Long have I waited for a moment like this. This is his way of apologizing for Orshifam. I just know it. There are certain times during the game that side quests will become temporarily locked. Temporarily unavailable until progress has been made through the main scenario. Okay, cool. So we'll have a lock on it. That's easy. <clears throat> May as well hear what he has to say. Don't go making me throw you back in there now, eh? Hey! Leave me alone! I'm baby! See, I'm busy here. Yeah. All right, let's see what we can uh, whip what up at the want? forge. 
Stormcry. Ooh, new weapon. So spurred by her cries, the wind becomes storm. Bastard sword. <laughs> kind of like that. Let's see. Um, let's, yeah, I mean, we have the wind shard. So this is like um, a Garuda weapon, right? So, um, yeah, I mean, let's fucking, let's get it. Should last you a good while. Yeah, let's equip it too. Okay, craftable, uh, dark sash, and this wolf skin sash. We have enough to make the dark one, so I guess we may as well that. equip it as well. And ooh, this boosts my HP too, apparently. Um, do I want? <sighs> yeah, fuck it. It's Should better. And oh shit! Wait, no. Let me see if I can reinforce anything. Quick. So would it be? I guess not. Wait. I can make this better. Fuck it, let's do it. Yeah, that should do you. And I can make this better. Fuck it, let's do it. The best work. But it'll cool, do. cool, 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 cool. Anything else? Is Clive the new Orshifon? What? <laughs> no, no one can replace Orshifon. Okay, no one. I have all those things equipped. Yeah, okay. No one is replacing my boy. Thank you for the hydration. Sorry I'm in and out right now because I don't want to see much, but I hope you enjoyed your Popeyes. I did, Pars. I did. I think Stormcry is the same sword as Benedictus. Ooh. That would actually make sense if it is, honestly. One second, chat. Sorry we killed your elf. Here's a traumatized hero to mend the wounds. And honestly, I'm not complaining. Like, I'll take it. I'll take it. All the sad boys, I will adopt. I will be their mommy, okay? I'm not afraid. Hey, Yoshi P. Orshavon's Cheeks DLC when? Oh, give it to me. I need that. Look what we Is it Karen or Sharon? It's Karen, right? Go on, then. Go on, then. Um, I want to sell... Are you fuck? Okay, no, it's not as good as the one that I have on right now. Breath of the Wind reduces Rook's Gambit cool. Oh, I'm not really using her ability, so I'm not gonna bother. Um, I kind of want to buy potions, but I feel like that's a wa <laughs> that's a waste. Um, all right, so increase attack power, increase defense. Okay, sell. I have a lot of things I need to sell. Um, we'll sell this. Like, I don't need it. I have a better so weapon now. I don't need the iron belt I anymore. I don't need this belt. anymore. These I'll keep. These I'll keep as well. And those I'll Finished, keep as well. Uh, yes. So that quest is locked. There's something here. Oh, this is like the training area, right? Is it pronounced Aret? Aret? Men's training. Yeah, so this is where I could like practice, right? Which would be- which is like handy. Okay, yeah. So this is just like the main attack, right? So I don't understand how Phoenix Shift like actually works. Like how do you charge it? Like what charges it? Like I don't know what the cooldown on it is. Let me see. Abilities. Where is it? Where is it? Is it, is it this? I, yeah, I, I don't know, like, how, what turns it on. Yeah, that's a, um, that's a strawberry milk question, actually. Presently here, hello, how are you? Hello, hello. I do have a ton of ability points. Flames of Rebirth, summon a massive pillar of fire that burns all enemies caught within the flame while also partially restoring Clive's HP. I don't have enough, but I want that. The hitting triangle on nose on the screen shows you what the upgrades do. Oh yeah, yeah, I learned that yesterday. Yeah, like what is the charge on that ability? Like, I don't. This is what is really cool. So I feel like once I buff it, it'd be better. It's 
Integration is an iconic key with those circle buttons. If those don't have to run, you can zoom whenever. No, but sometimes it doesn't go off. Sometimes I'll use it and it doesn't like pop. That's enough. That's what my like what my big question about it is. I'll be using it in a fight and nothing happens. Is this one connected to the others? Um, they it references some of the others, but in no way are they like I wanna say like actually connected. That is a good question though. Okay, I completely forgot how to get out of this. Okay, it's not that, it's not that. It's is it here? And training, yeah, it is. It's just for dashing in and starting slash continuing combos. Okay, so maybe that's why like in certain segments it doesn't pop off for me. Okay. I'm not sure in what circumstances your Phoenix wouldn't be working. Maybe you're in another animation. Yeah, maybe. Maybe that's what it is. Like maybe I'm trying to do a combo and I'm like I'm hitting it too soon. That could be it. Although I thank you for doing I'll keep it in mind going forward. Don't. Well, still have a bit of fight left in you. Then listen. Oh, look at the sword. In case you've Sick. forgotten, you're the one he's been putting his nose to work for. For nothing. Bob, you're so broody. Just listen. While you've been relaxing in your cell, Gav's been busy sniffing out your dominance. And according to his last report, he's picked up a scent. Gav's gone to a fair bit of trouble for you. The least you can do is hear the poor bugger out. He's going to meet us at the King's Fall. Pack your stuff. We'll leave as soon as you're ready. Alright, let's go let's go chit chat with Gav. Okay, how do we do this again? This? No, but I can read these now. Let's see. Since voice actor sounds familiar, dude is always a bad guy in movies. Um yeah, Ralph Innocent or whatever. He's fantastic. He's a he's a phenomenal actor. His voice, like, I really hope to hear him in more video games moving forward. Either way, Phoenix Shift is very useful for gap closing. Yeah, it's, that's normally what I use it for. And I'll take you from ground to an elevated target, like a big enemy's head, like in the crew to fight. Yeah, that I noticed as well. Um, when I was using it, it would, like, it would put me in the air, and I'd be doing aerial combos, which is really, really cool. An Imperial Bear turned deserter. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, so the Hooded Man. I, I, I feel like this is Joshua. The more that I'm thinking about it, the more I'm certain it's Joshua. A mysterious man that many believe to be a dominant of fire. Clive first saw him at Phoenix Gate on the night of the Imperial invasion, and for years believed him to be the dominant of the icon that killed his brother. But to Clive's eternal ch chagrin, he has proved otherwise. I feel like this is just like a figment of his imagination, and if it's not, then it's, it has to be Joshua. I feel like it's Josh. This faithful scout who puts his legendary nose to work in tracking the movements of slavers, soldiers, and any other object of interest to the hideaway. The ever agreeable fellow only too gladly delving behind the enemy lines if he can get a good story or two out of it. Playing through this right now myself. Glad I finally get to watch someone play it and no spoilers for me. You're welcome! It's a good thing I'm taking my very, very, very sweet time with this. Uh, how do we use the map again? Okay. Beauty. Easy. I love it when things just like spawn on the map. I know exactly where I'm going. <laughs> Gav is very pretty. He is very pretty. Oh, this is pretty too. The King's Fall, the Holy Empire of Sinbreak. Sinbreak. I love Clive's armor, honestly. Not so long ago, this here was a thriving trade route. Then the blight came. Mm. The people left. And just like that, it was deserted. Making it the perfect little shortcut. Gab's waiting for us up ahead. Come on. Still feeling sorry for yourself? Well, how can't he? Don't. Please. Think about it, Clive. 
The room is all points of That's not Gav, is it? That was an Imperial signal. Mm. They shouldn't be here. The old fort's been abandoned for years. Our little chat can wait. I need to see what the bastards are up to. You go on ahead and meet up with Gav. But we both know that. No buts about it. Sid can handle himself. Sid's fine. The hunter and the hunted. This says five isn't his type, but I've been on AO3 and I disagree! Oh, don't fucking kill me. I can't wait to start writing my own fanfic for this. I don't know what it's gonna be. Maybe an AU? Who knows? How many hours have you played? Oh, I don't know. I know it would tell me like somewhere here i know how to do it on the ps4 am i at z total progress zero percent zero percent oh that's chapter progress oh <laughs> Oh, okay, I was like, are you fucking for real? Yeah, okay. 60% when you're first launching the game? 60? There's no way I'm at 60. What? There's no way. So it doesn't tell me here. Let's return to title. Is it on the title screen somewhere here? Or do I have to like exit out completely oh, would it be in here 10 10 i am 10 percent okay am i 10 percent through or do i have 10 percent trophies there's a bar in the main ps5 menu when you select the game can i select the game here? I'm on the home screen. Hold on. You mean like down here? This? 30%? This? Okay, we are only 30% through. We got a long fucking way. We got a long fucking way to go. We sent Gav on a wild goose chase. Ooh, where am I going? Do I jump down? What do I do? Oh, I do! Hey, yo, what's up? Oh, now he's all now he's all broody and sad. No, you can't make me like you anymore. Okay. Stay down. You're not allowed to be broody, Clive. Like I don't know how to tell you this, but I can't be that much of a simp. I really can't. This is bad for my health. Oh, my bad, my bad. I forgot I could do it, actually. Nice! Level up! Hell yeah. Ooh! Two potions and four sharp fangs? Don't mind if I do. I don't know the 30% also considers optional stuff. I don't think I've done any optional stuff yet. There's a lot of oh, there's a lot of things in this game that I, I've only been doing the MSQ, right? So there's a lot of things that I've definitely missed. At some point I'll, What was that? What was that? Oh! 
What's up, big boy? I like your loincloth. Did you get it made yourself? Oh, hello. My jump. I fucked that up. Oh! Okay, I tried to evade and I couldn't. That's fine. It's a shame I can't knock him off the edge, eh? Oh, are you kidding? fucking fun oh i love the combat in this game it's so fun it's so satisfying cool minus for main Ooh. hello micah mo what's up can i cut off his pee pee and wear it around my neck What's wrong with that? You don't like a little challenge? You don't like to fight a little bit, Clive? I thought you had a lot of anger in you. <laughs> oh, my bad. What a nice looking game. Oh my god, Cosmos. This game is gorgeous. Look at it. Listen to it. It is incredible. Look, I can even pet the dog. I can pet Torgol. Look. Ah, <laughs> Not gonna lie, I didn't look at the title when I clicked and I was like, when did Pepper become a Chad? <laughs> Don't worry, Pepper will always stay a beautiful, adorable Mikote, okay? Can't be much further now. I will never get rid of my sweet Pepper. This is on PS5. I don't think it's out for PC yet. Or I don't know if it's gonna be out for PC at all. It might just be on a PS5 exclusive, honestly. Let's see. Let's see what I can do with this. Ooh. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it is about Garuda, but I'm not feeling it. I don't know. Maybe it's just because like I'm I'm biased and I like fire abilities. I don't know. Fire abilities are cool. Distance, boy. Give 
Locked on to. How do I miss that? Stay down. Ooh, nice. Garuda's for stunning. Best to use for staggering bosses. Ooh, okay. I'll keep that in mind. I will keep that in mind. It'll come to PC eventually, and I'm modding these big thigh embedded to stockings as you fucking should. Not petting the game. Petting the dog in this game would be the worst torture. I know. After everything that we go through with Torgal, like, he deserves some head pats. <laughs> Hello, Kenzo! I am feeling better. Not like completely better, but I mean well enough to. Oh, another one. Uh, come on. Let me through. Well enough to. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You know what to do. <laughs> well enough to stream is what I was trying to say. Oof. I didn't time that one. Not bad! That was fun! <laughs> he deserves head pass for that sick 360 next spin takedown. No, you're damn right. Torgal is a beast. He is a force that should not be reckoned with. Can you switch freely between Phoenix and Gruta? You can. Just like that. See? All you have to do is hit the L2 trigger button and boom. Beam, boom, boom, beam, boom, beam, boom. Very easy. Puppy, my puppy going in front of me. My puppy going in front of me. Don't do it. Don't jump. For Torgo. Keep going for Torgo. Oh. What's that, Gav? Gav? Let's go help Gav. Let's go help Gav. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. Who goes there? At me. This one Chloe. Take his head. Out of my way. You made your choice. Ain't no, ain't no way, ain't no way. Ah! That's enough. You're dodging those two, bro? Okay, you're in a corner. I'm gonna fucking leave you and I'll do this. Yeah, we'll do it. Yeah, okay, okay. I forgot that some of them can like dodge my abilities. I didn't realize they could dodge it like that. Oh, hello, it's an astrologer. Uh, heals in this economy? I don't think so. You're already almost dead, anyways. Yeah, there we go. Is that it? Yeah. Oh! 
Another Dragoon! Oh shit. Oh my god. A Dragoon with his Dragoon? <laughs> Where Sid comes in, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Clive, what's the situation? You're late. Get in trouble. What? The Imperials are on his tail. We have to get to him before they do. Understood. I'm here to even the odds. Any objections? I would if I could focus on the dragoon. Oh, okay, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. I did not time that well at all. Ow. Oh, oi, 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 Just a dragoon now. Sick. My wounds, boy. Ah! Dude, this guy is huge. Like this dragoon is like so much taller than me and Sid. Are we baby boys? Dragoon abilities on me, bro, please. I'm just a baby. Holy, holy. Oh my god, I got fucking stuck. Must come down. Fun. That was fun. Oh my close to leveling up. Did I level up? Oh, -ho! leveled up. Level 19, baby. <laughs> so fucking cool. So fucking cool. Boris, hello, what's up? What the fuck are they feeding these dragoons of the Empire? I don't know. They're huge, and I'm kind of into it. I like me a big boy, so. Hmm. But like, canonically, how tall is Clive and Sid? Cause that dude was huge! Like the fucking mountain from Game of Thrones. Oh, Gav. Oh, Gav.
How are we faster than Torgal? That's what I want to know. Shit! Oof. Where's Gav? Is he just chilling down there? He's fine, right? Is he hanging about? Yep. He's only got one arm. We got this. Oh my god. It's br it's busted. It's so. B oh my god. Ma'am, we're sorry to inform you. Your son was kicked off a cliff by a dog. <laughs> Five doesn't have your nose, I said. He'd stumble off a cliff, I said. Well, that's a trouble with a nose like mine. Can't help sticking it where it's not wanted. <laughs> but if it wasn't for you two, my sniffing days would be over. Well, thank you. Truly. So, what news? Well, uh, found out where your friend's heading, for one thing. Gav, I... Him and his mate are on their way to mm. your old stomping ground. Rosaria. Oh, shit. You should have seen what they did to the Imperials who tried to stop them. There's no question about it. He's a dominant fire, all right? It's Joshua. No, he is. It's literally. I saw you turn into an icon it's gotta be. Eyes. And yes, there's a good chance it was you who killed the Phoenix. <laughs> but we weren't alone, were we? There was the fellow you saw enter the whirlwind. Mm -hmm. I, I saw him too. Okay, so it's not a figment of Five's imagination. You didn't dream it, Clyde. Yeah. He's out there. But who is he? Don't ask me. I don't bloody know. But I do know one thing. You're gonna find him and find out. After all, you swore an oath. What? You swore you'd avenge your brother's death. That you'd never rest until you'd hunted down the man responsible. So? Find out if this man's responsible and kill yourself if he's not. Sid, I don't thank me. Thank Gav. Damn. Damn. Sid really said, "Well, go kill yourself then." Oh my thank god. You, yeah, there you No birds returning this year. The deadlands have swallowed their roosts, like as not. I'm telling you, this is Joshua. Otherwise, it's Asahi. It's the Joshua! Time. It is! It is! It is! The hair! We'll be in Rosaria in a day or two. I know it. I know it. I know it. I know it. And because he's like the little princeling, he's staying hooded. So people don't like. Back to See where him. it all began. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Stopped. What did I say? It's Gratia. <laughs> oh my god, it's the 
Crystal Exarch. Oh my god. Ah! Amazing, 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 amazing. Ah! Ah! <laughs> the plot thickens, babes. It's thickening. I'm telling you, it's thickening. Oh, all right. Baconator, I am having fun. Archaeoxus, hello. Is that like Arceus and Deoxys combined? Hello, hello. I am going to take a quick break, friends. I have to go pee pee. Um, I will leave you with this beautiful BRB screen and this music in the background. I'll see you in about two minutes.
Okay. I'm back. I'm back, and I'm ready for more, babes. I'm ready for more. Uh, how are we feeling, chat? How's everybody doing? A little roll call, a little roll call. Are we all good? Are we all here? Are we all present? Are we all comfy cozy? Do we have snacks? Did everyone pee? Uh, yes, I did have a good poop. It was a poop and a pee. I'm thriving right now. Oh my god, it's really weird, like, looking at my, my camera because it's on this side. I'm used to it being on this side. And honestly, I kind of want to put it back over here. What's a better corner for the stream, guys? This side? Or... Oh, shit. Or this side. This side covers up some text, but you can see my... Yeah, you can, you can see my combos if I put it on this side. Yeah, I'm gonna flip it. I think this might be better. What do we think? You were gone for the perfect amount of time for me to see the cutscene in a fi in 5.0 MSQ. Meant to be. How's that going for you, Alec? How's the MSQ treating you? Wait, Lonely, hello, Lonely, how are you doing? It's nice to see you. I'm glad you're well, Kay. I'm glad you're well. Oh. Okay, I've been here. Look, it didn't register, okay? Sometimes I don't register usernames until like a little bit after. So is Final Fantasy XIV next Saturday then? Since you have it set as offline this Saturday? Yes, actually. Um, let me take a quick little preview at what my schedule for next week is going to look like. Okay, so this is what we're thinking for next week, okay? We are thinking Tears of the Kingdom on Monday, Final Fantasy 16 Wednesday, Final Fantasy 16 Thursday, Final Fantasy 16 Friday, Final Fantasy 14 Endwalker MSQ Saturday. That is roughly what I think the schedule is going to be. We'll see if it remains that way. For now, I think that's what it's gonna be. I'm excited. Five days of Syra? I know. I know, right? Me being a consistent streamer? Who would have fucking thought? Okay. Oh, excuse me. Let's go to the hideaway. Returning to the hideaway. Oh, excuse me. I don't have- oh, great gout of fire you was like a bleeding volcano. Volcano. You think I'm having you on? Clive! Your friend! She's awake! Right. <sighs> Go to her, you fool. Oh, Jill! Oh my god, Jill! <laughs> right, you lot. Enough slacking. Goats, come with me. Gav, go and get those wounds seen to. Oh, oh, give it to me straight. How long have I got? So I love him. All in good time. Let's make ourselves scarce. Jill. But the Moogle, can I go speak with the Moogle? Oh my god, I can. Is it the Moogle? <laughs> they even have a Moogle. I've never seen one in the flesh. Oh my god, it's so fuzzy. Well, here I am, so drink it in, Koopo. I'm sure it's said in my father's bestiary that they live deep in the forest. And that they never reveal themselves to humans. Hmm, he knows his stuff. What he doesn't know is that Nectar the Bull, there's no Nectar ordinary Moogle. Is that what Clive. it said? You understand Moogle tongue, Koopo? So it would seem. 
Finally! Kupo! Mm. We try and talk to these people, but none of them understand a word I say! That sounds painful. But now you're here! My pom pom is safe at last! You can hear me! You can actually hear me! I need to dress my dog up as a Moogle so badly. He would look so freaking cute, don't you think? Okay, on that note, let's go and find Jill. I think we have to go up here to get to the infirmary, right? Yeah. Let's get this fixed. Think the Moogle will deliver my marriage proposal to Gav? I fucking hope so. Then. It really is you. Oh. It is. Oh. Clive. Oh. Oh. You're alive. So are you. I still can't believe it. Your wounds healed. Yes. Kaya told me what happened. You saved my life. After nearly taking it, I had no idea. Forgive me, but how did you ever come to be there, Jill? Fighting for them. I love her hair. The Iron Blood. They invaded not long after the news arrived about Phoenixgate. Rosaria had lost her leaders. The duchy was in chaos. The Iron Kingdom saw our weakness and pounced upon it. They killed the men and captured the women. And took you back to Ironhome. I thought they meant to have their fun with me before the end. Mm. But the end never came. My powers awoke and everything changed. It all happened so fast. We were told that the Iron Blood had captured a dominant and planned to bring her on their latest crusade. Mm. They gave me a choice. To fight for them on the battlefield, or to see my countrywomen slaughtered. Mm. And they call us dominant. What? What happened to Clive? What happened at Phoenix Gate? It was me. I killed Joshua. No, that's not true. I know you, you wouldn't do that. It's the truth. I changed into him again, not long ago. The second icon of fire. The one responsible. <laughs> Clive. Back to that night. The hooded man, he, he spoke to me. What did he say? We should go back there, to Phoenix Gate. I need to know what really happened, and so do you. You need to know for certain. And if what you told me is true, and you did what you said you did... 
Then we will face it together. Jill, I... All right. You'll be needing a change of clothes, then. Out you go, your lordship. We wouldn't want you getting overexcited. Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry. Ludities. I'll see you soon then, Clive. I should be ready too. We've a long journey ahead of us. Ah, uh, so are we actually gonna go back to Phoenix Gate then with her? Oh my goodness. Okay, time to fucking go through that trauma. Good night, Kay. I'm sure you're already gone now, but I hope you enjoy your movie. I'm still laughing that the only cry so far has been from the R2 mechanic. I know. I literally haven't cried at all apart from getting overstimulated. <laughs> the tism was tisming. Okay, I think I saw that there are new recipes. Ooh, and side quests. Let's see. What's this? Is this the wood no. one? What's the matter? It's my assist. I cannot be. They need soil. Do I have soil? I don't know. But I'll collect right. the quest. Enough. We're about to show Tan's blood to stop. Okay. Go. Okay. Sick. Sick. Cool. Can I just like hoard these? This is the wood one, right? This whole place. <sighs> yeah, this is the wood one. Uh, I'll just collect it. Why fight. not? No, I said ask. Thanks. Okay. Cool. Picked it up. Oh my god. So is Clive and Jill, like, are Clive and Jill, like, gonna be, like, the romance? Is that gonna be a thing? I'm here for it. I am so here for it. Okay, so they'll, they'll just all appear on the side there. Okay, not really a fan of that, but whatever. Um, where is the. Okay, here's the smithy. Let's see what's new here. What's that for, you? Gaia Blade? I don't think that's any better than what I have right now. Oh, it is. It is remarkably better. And I can get it. Okay, sure. Because of the Minotaur scratches, main I have. Right. Okay, that's not any better. Hmm, this is, though. Lost you a good while. Okay, reinforce. What can we improve? I kill another Minotaur. Do you say Minotaur or Minotaur? Yeah. What do you say, Fun. chat? Oh, this is part of the quest I'm doing. Excuse me. The man working over by the garden sent me to fetch some wood. Oh, this is really nearby. Oh, that was easy. Master Carpenter. Luck would have it, we've just finished cutting the timber he's after. Oh, nice. You take as much as you need from the stack. Perf. Thank you. That's so simple. Not at all. We appreciate the assistance. I just farted. Did you hear that? Did you hear that? I didn't even realize I was gonna fart. It just kind of came out. Here we are. Yeah, that's Gotta how you collect uh, planks, chat. Jeffrey, was it? Minotaur, minnow, minitor. I say mino. I don't know why. Minotaur, mine, mine, a minimor, minor. <laughs> oh, you're back. Hope fetching that wood wasn't too much trouble. Mm, fetching wood is the least of my worries. Oh, just one plank? Or maybe it was a bundle. Will this be enough? This will do nicely. Thank you. That sounds oh, it's not as bad as all that. And now stop fretting and there's no need. That's not a map. Okay, cool. I'm assuming that was like a like a quest that's not really gonna build into anything. And that is not a pun. Because he's building. Oh, okay. And a gill bug. A gill bug can be traded for gill? Who the fuck do I swap a gill bug with? There's another side quest over here. Oh, what I wouldn't give for some wild mickleberries. Mickleberries? What is a mickleberry? Ooh, where's Karen or Sharon or whatever her name is? <laughs> is she like somewhere funny. around here? Hmm. I just don't have enough. Ooh, the, or the orchestrian. Can what can we play here? 
Do I have any music? We have the hide hideaway to track. And where the heart is. Oh, this is so cute and moody. Ah, a new face. And dare I hope, a willing pair of hands. What do you want the my hands Chocobo for? Chocobo is a demanding mistress, and we are too few to keep her on her feet. Might I persuade you to deliver a meal or two to souls in need of sustenance? For your trouble, I can offer you the contents of my strong box and my enduring gratitude. Watch there be like nothing of importance in the strong box. I don't see why not. Oh, is that 500 gil? Am I getting 500 exactly gil for doing do this side quest? Daddy. Works, Delighted too. to make your acquaintance, Clive. I'm Kenneth, and mine are the weary shoulders upon which the weight of this fine establishment rests. Now, I have three hungry customers awaiting their victuals. Take these if you would, and be careful, they're hot. Alrighty, let's go feed some people. You know what? I really like the, the ambience of these side quests. I'm not really sure what it is but assisting in the hideaway food. Is, is satisfying I was hoping it and because be. these have like well, full-fledged cutscenes it makes it all the you more like one, worthwhile you know it's running your ragged already I expect you old rascal well he did say he'd give me something for my trouble <laughs> and so he should we're not slaves anymore well met, lad, and keep up the good work. Thank you. And there should be two more. There's someone over here. Oh, this music is so pretty. Yeah. Oh, my thanks. <laughs> this, oh, um, do not think me lazy for the track that's playing in the background the makes this quest seems so gentle and sweet you left me half lame truth be told oh that seed took me in nonetheless <laughs> well the hideaway is the home i never knew and a mighty fine one at that Aww. hard day's work i love this I like that even NPCs are kind of getting key roles in the quest. Me too. That is what I find really appealing about this. It's they're fleshed out, you know. They serve purpose, and it's not just to fill up a fill up a space. It's more compelling to collect free herbs or whatever when they're going to voice act some lore at you for your trouble. Exactly. Well, that's the thing. It feels worthwhile, you know. more to farming than just seeds and soil <laughs> uh, your food just a moment i need to finish this hey, puppy. i won't be a burden i'm of no use to anyone as i am but maybe if i can master this all right then see that you eat it before it gets cold of course hey, my Thank poor you. goal is here with me now i don't That's have the last one I'd better let Kenneth know. I don't have anything for him. But he's here. Hi, baby. What's going on, Mama? Did you have a good nap? Did you have good sleepies? Hi, Waldo. I don't know what my plan is. doing? Big head? Hold on! Honestly, playing games like this that have like dog companions or any kind of like pet 
like any kind of companion really um really makes me oops makes me appreciate my dog more i i don't really know how to describe it but i just i feel i don't know i look at my dog and i get emotional there was that part in final fantasy 14 i think it was final fantasy 14 that really made me think of waldo and i got emotional I don't remember what Yours scene it was. Oh, with, with, um, with Seto. You could say that. And, Ard and Ardberg. Well then, allow me to welcome you. I am Harpocrates II Hyperboreus. Harp That's, uh, <laughs> quite a mouthful, I know. Which is why Harpocrates? everyone here has taken to calling me simply Tomes. Oh, I like that. On account of the uh, company I keep. And what varied company. I'm a collector, you see. Not of bijou and baubles, but of stories. The history and culture of these isles have ever been a source of endless fascination to me. But alas, my days of wandering the realm in search of new tales are far behind me. And so I've taken to sharing that which I've gathered with all who might listen. Hmm. Perhaps you would care to listen. Um, necessarily right now i have a few new notes that might interest you the thousand tomes is a comprehensive compendium of valician lore or how to pronounce that again covering everything from basic terms to important persons geography and history oh past active time lore entries can also be I viewed here i have some new entries if you would like to see them live tells oh oh oh, oh. There is a rather <laughs> fascinating excerpt I've been meaning to show you. I love this. The calendar. The dating system used throughout the twins, which marks the years of the realm that have passed since the signing of the Continental Accord some 800 years ago. In centuries since, nations have ri risen and fallen, and the conquered between them has faltered, but the calendar persists. Egus? Oh, these two. Dating back to antiquity, the term Egai has historically been used to describe those ethereal entities that can be conjured by dominance. Okay. Egais? Egus? Egais? Are capable of casting potent magic. Magics correspond to the elemental alignment of their creators. Though unquestionably formidable, they will fade immediately should the dominant who gave them being happen to be slain. Yeah, that's what Sharada and Saparn are. What subject shall we consider today? This is really neat. I like this. I like this. I love the layout of this too. Oh shit, and it keeps all the tabs as well. Uh, I like it, I like it, I like this a lot. And now I can just go back there and refresh my memory. Oh, I love this! Hello, well, Brand Jam, how are you? Splendid. They were bearers. All three of them. Not slaves waiting upon their master's pleasure, but men waiting to be fed like equals. Yeah. Indeed. Equality is the very cornerstone upon which our little community is founded. I love Beyond this. Beyond these walls, we are scorned as slaves. Speaking only when spoken to, eating only what scraps our masters deign to give us. Mm -hmm. The first hot meal here is the first many will have known. In the hideaway, we are free. Truly free to speak as we please, when we please, and to eat what and when we desire. More than reason enough to trust in Sid's vision, wouldn't you say? Now, I promised you something for your trouble, did I not? The contents of my strongbox are yours to do with as you will. Thank you, Clive. Do come and visit me again, won't you? Absolutely. I'm sure you'll have more side quests for me. Words! Hello, how are you? How are you? Is it an in song? I don't know. I don't know what it's reminding you of. It is very pretty though, nonetheless. Treasure coffers. Hmm. Do a little kick. Badge of metal. Right. I'm assuming that is something that I can wear. Increases defense by 10%. Or by 10. I think. 
tank. Oh, this one increased attack by by seven. I think. I think we'll keep it. We'll keep it the way that it is. Ooh, let me see. How are my abilities looking? 144. Can't afford this yet. I can upgrade these though. Increase hits. Increase hits. Magic burst. Okay, I don't use that that much. It's gonna dodge with circle at the moment of an enemy attack. I don't like this, but it allows you for. Have I even have I even been been doing well with the precision dodges? I have been actually. And so if I master it, it extends the trigger window. Let's see, lunge. I've I used lunge, I've used it a couple of times. Let's see. Stomp is fun. What does mastering it do? Increases the maximum kick by two. Charged magic. I've also been using this one. Reduces charge time. That would probably be nice. Hmm. I don't wanna boost these. I haven't used Heat Wave at all. I have it, but I I haven't set it to my um my thing here. I think that's how it works. Yeah, you gotta pick one. I like these ones though. The range one is pretty cool, but like speaking of range though, I should probably boost charge magic or master it. What does it do again? It was the the charge time? Yeah, we'll take that. We'll take that. Okay. I still don't know where Karen is. Oh, there she is. Oh, I do actually have to speak to her for the MSQ. What do you want? Well, that works out. Just say farewell. We're leaving. Good decision. Better that than buried out there in the black. Fair. You've got a lot to thank that girl for, you know. I know. And I will. Now. What do you really want? We both know you don't come here for conversation. <laughs> the Gaia Blade. Wait. Oh, mine is boosted. I was like, what? <laughs> Does she have anything new? No. Do I have anything that I can sell? I'm wearing the battle chain. Not out else? I will sell this. I reckon I can find a buyer. Yeah. Okay. Off you go then. So is that it? I just wanted to say goodbye to her. Was that I literally all? Oh, I'm just I'm, I'm fucking making my rounds. Okay. So your mind's made up, is it? We'll be leaving for Rosaria as soon as we're able. Back down memory lane, eh? Rosaria ain't what she used to be, Clive. Well, not since the Imperials moved in. A sign of trouble, you make a straight for Martha's so rest green. and ask for the landlady. Oh She's a friend goodness. of the cause. Tell her you was Sid, and she'll help you out. Not a promise. Understood. <laughs> Thank you, Gav. Yeah. I'd be lost without you. Yeah, I'm just doing my job. No need yeah, I was like, don't get all fuss. touchy with me. You take care, all right? Oh, I'm crap at goodbye. <laughs> you sit when you need him. Give him my regards when he gets back. I will. He looks so amazing. Ready. My lady. My lady. Ready. Oh my god, romance. <laughs> All righty. All right, so we're going here. Wee wee. Caleb, thank you for the 46 month resub. Hello, Lucas. He gets so shy and adorable when Clive is being kind to him. Who gap? It's very sweet. Shout, thank you for the 43 months. Thank you. Rosaria. 
Rosaria. It's been 13 years. But this breeze, the smell of the grass, it's just as I remember it. Aww. You haven't been back either. I couldn't. Bran did keep a close watch on each other in the Imperial Army. You get beheaded just for knowing a deserter. Mm. The only way out was on a mission. I see. But mostly I was afraid. <gasps> He's being vulnerable. Afraid to go back. to you. It's so sweet. It's so sweet. We should press on. Homecoming. Did you see the mood the board that Ben tweeted rest. earlier? I did. The Torval mood board. But can we say the same for her patrons? Imperials don't tend to take well to those with my mark. If anyone asks, I'm a branded soldier, sworn to protect my noble mistress. Noble mistress, eh? I just noticed how blue his eyes are. Yeah. It's funny, I was actually just thinking, I wish Clive's eyes were brown. They're very blue. They're like ocean blue. It's kind of crazy. Oh, hello. Look at the fusion. Ah, that's so pretty. Am I able to fight anything here? We're not alone. Ah, I didn't know why I messed up. Okay, let's see the chart time on that. Oh, it's so much better now. Way better. Uh, what did I just do? It's over. Thank you. Way quicker. Oh, okay, yellow. What do we pick up? Five sharp fangs. We love to see it. We love to see it. Oh, there's an item over there. Let's go get it. Let's go get it. Okay. Okay, so the distance on that is not as uh, not as good as I anticipated. Man, not bad. I always fuck that up. Always without fail. Okay, Miss Shiva, I see you. Ooh, am I somehow gonna unlock Shiva's abilities? Am I gonna have to fight Jill? Could you imagine? Oh no. Oh no, the trauma, the horror! What was this? More sharp fangs. Don't mind if I do. I will take those. The music carries my heart out, to be honest. It's such a sad rendition of the same song Soldier singing back in the fall of Clive's dad. Oh! Wait, actually? Is that what that is? Oh man! I think I remember exactly what scene you're talking about. It was in the tavern right before the invasion, right? Is that what you're talking about? They never finished Full the soundtrack of this game After comes out next week. Gate, it didn't seem the highest priority. Well, I don't think I'm going to be done by then, but we'll see. I don't want to listen to anything that's going to give me spoilers. Traveling trader. You couldn't give me an iron, could you? Bloody bearer. Just hey. when I thought my luck had changed. Hey, I'm not just a bearer, I'm also a dummy. I'm a daddy dumb. Though it pains me to use another man's branded. Here, you understand me, don't you? I need your help. These blasted birds must have caught whiff of my cargo and yeah. they got me surrounded. Well, it's very late as it was. I've got something special needs delivering before the rest. 
But I dare not leave my cart untended. You couldn't run it up to Martha's rest for me, could you? Needs to get there a quick mind. I'm not gonna get any gill for it, but it's all in the way, isn't it? That's the spirit. All right. Here. You hand that to the stable master and no one else. I'm owed a little something for it. If he gives it to you, pass it along to your master by way of thanks. Be off with you then. And don't go taking To my master, eh? What's a bird wants? All right, shoo, chocobos, shoo. Shoo. Go. <laughs> Yeah, it's literally all in the way. This is fine. I don't mind doing this. We're not gonna fight those. Whee! Yeah, if this game makes me fight Jill when she's like Shiva, that's gonna be hard. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fucking do that. I have a bad feeling about it, though. I have a very bad feeling. Are you the stable master? I was asked to deliver this to you. Field crate. Here you go. This is for me, right enough. Mm -hmm. Not sure what some bearer is doing bringing it to me, though. Where's that fool of a peddler got to? He couldn't come himself. His cart's surrounded by wild chocobos. Hmm. Huh. Sounds about right. I'll have it full of Gizal Greens, no doubt. Crammed with them, if I know him. Gizal Greens? Chocobos go mad for them, don't they? And if you forget to seal the car up tight... Isn't that the same thing the from Final Fantasy XIV? The thing that around. looks like lettuce? Don't get me wrong. They're a fine investment for a savvy merchant. Especially around these parts. But you can't get greedy. As our mutual friend is learning the hard way. Still, I got my wares, and that's all that matters. Be sure to pass your master my regards. On every FF? Yeah, that's fair. Every FF game. My bad, my bad. Look, I've only played Final Fantasy XIV, so that's my only reference. Got some hide, yeah, and some fangs. Good girl. You get There's someone would say that to me. I like catnip for chocobos. That is cute. They go crazy for them, huh? Juan, hello! I was tempted to climb this guy's cause I was spite, but completionist brain made me do it. See, oh, that's my that's my problem guys. with these games. Sometimes it's like, okay, I don't I'm want to do this quest. I don't want to assist you. I don't want to be nice, but I have to. It's music. This tavern. Or inn. Hello, Martha. I like her head wrap. Excuse me. Would you happen to be the landlady? Depends who's asking, and why they have an imperial bearer with them. For protection, which mm. hopefully won't be needed. Smart. If you can advise me on the safest route to the west. It's your friend here I'd be worried about. Mm. Bearers don't have an easy time of it in Rosaria. Even a strapping lad like him might attract the wrong kind of attention. Strapping lad, you say? Snapped, it ain't likely to end well for you either. Then we'll just have to stay out of the malicious way. Gav said you might be able to help us. Follow me. Sorry for before. Can't be too wary of strangers asking questions in our game. I'm Martha, an old friend of Sid's. He said he had high hopes for a bearer who joined recently. I expect that's you. These cutscenes are doing the things so, that the Dragon Age cutscenes do, where they have like escapes. the particles, like like the Boca particles, like answer. floating around. Is that so? The dust. Well, if you want to avoid the garrison, the road through Eastpool's your best bet. Or it would be, if the bridge hadn't collapsed. Hmm. 
right blooming nuisance it is. We've had no trade with the village for weeks. I did ask our carpenter to take a look at it. But he went out on another job. And he hasn't come back. Do you think something might have happened to him? Fingers crossed he's just taking his time. The alternative didn't bear thinking about. We'll find him. And make sure he's safe. We both need that bridge repaired. Your carpenter sounds like the man to do it. I see why Sid's got such a soft spot for you. If you could, I'd be in your debt. I love that they both just did the same thing. Right. They did the little went down into the marshes quiet nod. Bridge. The one by the fallen gate. The marshes were dangerous at the best of times. I can't tell. Hide. Is Jill's hair blue or That's the gray? Way down, if you've a head for heights. Or is it Bray? His name is Bernard. Blay? Should you find him well? Grew? Martha sent you. And that he's wanted at the bridge to Eastpool. Bridge to Eastpool. Alrighty, alrighty. Hello, Torgal. Let's find that ladder. And give baby a pet. You like that, don't you? You like that, yeah? You like that, yeah? You like Daddy's big pet, yeah? Okay, find Bernard. Very okay. good to East Pool. Here's the gate. And that must be the ladder. Yep. Let's go down. That oh, wasn't that difficult. That's a long ass ladder though. Do I jump over? But no, we go down this way. I don't care. Hi Wooten, how are you? Hello, hello. What was that? Shoot, we gotta go protect him. Come on. Under the bridge? You know how strong is down there? Am I lost? Am I lost? Is it this? Is it here? Do I have to kill these things? There he is. Yeah, okay. Hold on, we're coming. my back. Woo! That didn't give me that much experience, but I got a little bit of gill and that's what matters. Thank you, my and lady. Then. You saved my life. Okay, her Not hair is definitely Bernard, gray. I think it's her I outfit that is I just like throwing me off. Is she a red so mage? I'm a friend of Martha. She's got a rapier. She come and, find you. and I recognize well, those gloves from Final before. Fantasy 14. I just finished checking these piles when I, I guess technically she's a blue mage. Monsters looking to, to feast on my flesh. If you hadn't come when you did, I'd have been I'm sorry. snipped into strips by now. We're just glad you're safe. I, I best go and give my regards to the landlady then, hey? Actually, she asked that if we found you, we should beg you make haste to repair the bridge to Eastpool. Of course. I, I said I'd take a look at it, but I it clean slipped my mind. I'll head up there straight away. Thanks, Bernard. wasn't so bad. Oh, the trusses are still sturdy. It's just a matter of replacing the stringers and relining the deck. I'll have it done in no time. Yeah, whatever that means. Thank you, Bernard. We were hoping to take the road to Eastpool ourselves. We're very grateful for your help. I'm sorry for asking this of you after what you've been through. I owe you my life. Fixing a bridge is the least I can do. Thank you, my lady. And you too, son. You're with Sid, ain't ya? Me and him can go way back. Not as far as Martha mine, but far enough. I see. Well, I best get cracking then. You go and let Martha know I'm all right, and she'll have her bridge back soon enough. We will. 
Let me guess, I'm gonna blink and it's gonna be repaired. <laughs> Pretty tired, but have to make the rounds. I hear you, Wooten. I hear you, I hear you. I'm good, though. Just sold my PC for a piece of shit car. I had to move out because I'm 19. Got a new job, so it's been hella lonely. I'm trying to stay positive with no way to get the anger out, but how, how are you doing, man? Toby, I am so sorry that it's happened to you. Life is gonna life sometimes, and we're never, we're not always gonna be happy about it. I'm doing well, bud. I'm doing well. Just suffering from the pizza I ate earlier? Wait, so your calzone didn't have like dairy, like, I guess like vegan cheese? Come on, Kelsey. Come on, girl. Do better. Do better for your bowels. Okay. Let's go talk to Martha. Oh, there was an item over there. Ah, you're back. What happened? Did you find Bernard? You did. We did. He's fine. And he'll have the bridge to Eastpool repaired soon. Oh, well, thank the founder Bill is for that. so pretty, isn't she? It was lucky we found him when we did. The creatures out there are not to be trifled with. It's the Blight's fault. They've nothing to eat in the north. I'm very Come excited to be able to look at Final Fantasy XIV art when I'm done he this game. Can't keep or going with 16 art. I'll have to arrange a guard for him. Can't really look at anything now because anyway, I'm scared I'm going to get you. spoiled. I don't have a lot to offer in return. But you're welcome to rest here until the repairs are finished. Thank you. See, I'm gonna blink and it'll be done. We'd be delighted. Do we get to share a room? Quest complete. So, building bridges. So, let me guess. One room, one bed, one bed trope. Hmm? Hmm? Can I get you a drink or anything while you wait? Flagon of Imperial Gold, perhaps? Tastes like swill, but it'll slake a thirst. No, thank you. I prefer the truth about why there are so few bearers around here. Mm. Yes, there were more of them when we were young. Far more. Is this the Empire's doing? Have they been sent away? to the legions or oriflam seems the oriflam. miners i remember head. that name having a hard time keeping up with demand of late so the bearers make up the shortfall time was they used to dole out crystals like sugar plums even down here in the provinces but not anymore nowadays they'll jump at any excuse to confiscate our bearers so they can be put to work elsewhere was knew the Empire treated their branded like shit, but after seeing it with my own eyes, well... Ah, dear! Congratulations on the new arrival! And you got a little laddie with you? It was a bearer. The boy I carried for nine long moons. Mm. A bloody bearer! Oh, you poor thing! You gave oh it to God. the constables then. Just left it at the garrison. I let them deal with it. Oh my God. Couldn't wait to be rid of the blasted thing. Oh my God. Been wanting it gone since the moment I found out. Oh my God. Well, it's all dealt with now. Could you imagine so that? Well done, eh? Mum, he weren't my brother, was he? No. But you'll have one soon enough. You just have to be patient. All right? All right. That's so sad. Imagine carrying a child for nine months it. and they're just giving it up like that. Bearers may have been looked down on back in Archduke Elwyn's day, but they were still human beings. Now they've fallen so far, a beggar wouldn't spit on them. So sad. Since you're not drinking, do me a favor and take that to the Abbey. There's a darkness, the heart of this world, and I'd have you see it. And we'll see it at an Abbey. Glademond Abbey, on the shore of Sorrowise Bay. The abbot there is a friend. Tell him Martha sent you, and he'll show you what I mean. 
Understood. So far, I'm honestly really enjoying um, a lot of the tropes in this game. Um, there are some things that like I raised a few eyebrows at, like some of the um, nods towards harassment to women. Um, feel like we didn't need that, but I guess it like sets the tone. Um, but yeah, like this need for acceptance and equality and equity amongst like the communities and just the nations. I, I love that. And like the goal that Sid has to like build a better future and nation where everyone can be treated as one and be like supported for like despite their differences. You know, I, I like that. I like that that is that that that's like one of the the themes that has been like repeating itself like throughout the story so far. Uh, monkey, is it monkey or monkai? Monkey Moira, Moira, Moira. Thank you for the raid. Hello, hello. My name is Sarah. I'm a Final Fantasy 14 streamer who is trying Final Fantasy 16 as my very first mainline FF game. Thank you so much. On the shore of Sorrowise Bay, Sad Town, Misery Land, the Doom Country. I know some of these names, eh? Okay, we're gonna wrap up in a little bit. I can feel my back what starting to after? like get to me a little bit. I do want to keep playing, but not at the risk. Or not, not risk, right? but not at the um. What's the word that I'm looking for? What's the word that I'm looking for? Like, it, like, not, like, not, like, not if I'm gonna be in pain, you know? I do be kind of ouch a little bit. Hope you're enjoying the game. I absolutely am enjoying the game. I'm sad that I'm taking a sweet, sweet, sweet time with it, but it is, it's very fun. It's been a long time since I've been able to enjoy a brand new video game. I'm very picky about the games that I play. We knew nothing of what it meant to be born that way, did we? No. Yeah, that shit is sad. Um, but yeah, I, I find it very difficult for me to find new games that I like to play. Um, I'm not really entirely sure why. Ooh, is that's a different chocobo? Oh, it's called a boober. And I get to kill it. And I will. It just looks like a fancy chocobo. And I feel kind of bad now. Oh no, I don't want to kill that one! No! No! Jill, no! Fucking whatever. Oh, hello? I feel bad. Oh, there's another one here. I'm fucking up the chocobos. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. This is so bad. I don't want to kill them, but I have no choice. Comfort is more important, exactly. Wait, Paris, you're still here? Aren't these spo- isn't this like- Isn't this spoiler territory for you? Cancelled? Oh my god, no, please. Listen, I still haven't done the Stay My down. Feisty Little Chocobo questline in Final Fantasy XIV. I don't want to hear it. I am pro Chocobo, okay? There's a reason I don't ride chocobos in that game. I do not support the the uh, animal abuse targeted towards chocobos. Oh my god, I made that fucker fly. <laughs> Good night, Wooten. Take care. Bye bye. I think bluebird enemies imply that chocobos are a bit like peacocks and that males have cover plumage to attract mates. Honestly, that's what I was thinking. I was like, ooh, it's kind of peacocky. I didn't say anything, though. I was too invested in the fact that I was killing a fucking chocobo. But I do like that theory. I mean, there are different kinds of chocobos, like, period, right? Like, there are the black ones, there are the brown ones, the yellow ones. The Garuda abilities are really fun. Like, I can't even... I can't even deny it. They're very cool, but I have a huge soft spot for anything fiery. I love a good fire ability. Okay, so how do I go over there? Like, can I just like... Go water? No, 
so I do have to just go the long way. All the way around here. I just love seeing monsters that are in Final Fantasy XIV in this game. It's fun as hell. I agree. I know. Every so often, I'm like, ooh, I know what that is. Wait, did I go? Am I going the right way? Yeah, I'm not. My bad. Okay. Right in here. And a big boy. A big horn, even. I don't know. Fucking Don't let them get away. <laughs> oh, that's fucking fun! God, this game is so fucking fun! I fucking hit the fade, hello? Nice. All right, what drops am I getting? Nothing? Just black blood? I'm get that from the fucking other guys. Oh, there was an item in, in Martha's area thing that I didn't pick up, but that's fine. I guess I'll get it another day. Okay, let's go this way. There's an item here. I don't really want to disturb the, the creatures, but whatever. Can I escape that, really, I guess? Can I bathe them again? I'm locked over there. That didn't go the way that I really wanted it to, but that's fine. can't cross this. What do you mean? It's not that deep. Okay, so this is a path that I could have just taken, but I got distracted by the big horn. <laughs> All right, fair, fair. Okay, so we're gonna make a hard left over here. It is what I got stream of. Just not paying attention to bigger things. I still got support. Oh, Paris, you are so sweet. Well, do not feel pressured, okay? I appreciate you hanging out, even though this is like low. Just kill the family with chocobos? I know, we're not gonna talk about it. You know what though? Clive doesn't count as me, okay? Clive is not Pepper. It'd be hilarious if you could have it the have enemy. mounted it for that move. That'd be fucking fun. Gloom Widow. Ooh, look at this fucking spider over here. One shot it. Fucking one shot it. Got some pretty decent fangs from that. Well. 
We got Torgal and Jill teamwork at the end there. The dream team. We are literally the dream team. Oh, so close leveling up. It'd be cool if I could get a mount in this game. Maybe if Torgal was a little bit bigger. <laughs> Good day to you. The Abbot of the Abbey. I'm afraid the Abbey is not open for public prayer. May Grieger go with you. We came to offer a donation from Martha. Why am I nervous? I see. Then please follow me. This is about to get dark, isn't it? This is about to get gloom and doom. I can already tell. I don't want to die. Please, Father. Stop, stop it for the pain. Thank you. The light. The fate. I don't want to die alone. It's all right. I'm here. Who are these people? Martha's bearers. She entrusted them to my care, that I might ease their suffering. To the extent that I can, for the time they have left. Not give them a swift mercy. Oh my god. Oh my god. has taken them. All of them. As it does every bearer forced to use their gift. With each draw on the ether, their bodies petrify, till all that remains is stone and pain, and so they are cast aside. There is nothing either Martha or I can do to change that, but we can at least strive to make their final hours a little more bearable. <laughs> Have faith, my son, for you shall rise again and find the happiness denied you in this life. Oh, this is so sad. Thank you. Oh, so. oh, and just like that, eh? I so must fast. offer you my own thanks for the medicine you so kindly brought. Mm. Ah, their final moments may be moments of peace. When next you see Martha, pray tell her that two more have succumbed. This is, this is so dark. It's so sad. We should get back to Martha's rest. Yes, we should. Ah. Ah. Shivers. Shivers. That's so sad. That's so, 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 so sad. And so they use and use and use their power until they're like nothing. Okay, there was something good, here. Peruse. Peruse. Back when we had proper leaders. Okay. 
I just want to say that the Pedro Pascal shirt is immaculate. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hello, Trader Bows. How are you? I've been too busy to play myself, so I get the experience for you for right now. Well, you're welcome, Pars. This game is sending you hither and thither. Thither! No, get thither away from me. Ah, you're back. Thanks for taking care of that. The abbot had a message for you. Two more have succumbed. I see. Come upstairs. So, now you know, eh? I've seen plenty of bearers die on the battlefield. But never like that. And all because they were born different. The powers that be can't take away their gift. So they strip them of their humanity instead. Oh, there's plenty who pity a bearer's plight. But so long as we're content to sit around, weeping for those on whose broken backs we're carried, we ain't gonna change nothing. And so you lend Sid your strength? What little of it I have. Use profits from this place to buy the poor buggers. So when the abbot told us the bearers were yours? Aye. They're my property, at least by law. Any still fit to work fetch a price beyond my means. All I can do is care for those who have passed mend and... But it's not all doom and gloom. Bonid's finished fixing that bridge for you. You can carry on to Eastpool now. Well, at least there's that. Got questions that need answering, ain't you? Well, I wish you luck. Thank you, Martha. Oh, I almost forgot. Sid and I have other friends in Rosaria. Wear this and they'll know you for one of us. Another sigil? Or a seal, rather? Yeah, okay. The slumbering chocobo. And know that you will always be welcome here. You were Amen. right, Sid. It really is them. Lord Rosfield and Lady Warwick have come back to us. And long may they stay. Our names go well together, if I do say so myself. <laughs> Thank you for the biddies, Casper. I appreciate it. I've been looking for the past 30 minutes. This game looks fun and you're so cute. You have a nice smile. I'm not playing Final Fantasy game. This is a part of the series, right? Ruby, thank you. That's very sweet of you to say. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, so this is actually the second Final Fantasy game that I've ever played. All Final Fantasy games are their own narrative, so each one is completely different. If they are, like, I think there's only, like, maybe a couple that are, like, part of, a, like, a, like, a actual series, like, continuation of one another. Um, but yeah, they're all their own, uh, own narrative with characters that are reoccurring, like, an alternate universe, kind of. Um, so Final Fantasy 16 is the newest installation in the series, and it's also a standalone, um, it's very cool. I'm seeing a lot of references to Final Fantasy XIV, and it just makes it makes me get all giddy. It's a lot of fun. A new badge. Wait, who's got a new badge? Oh, me! I thought you meant someone in chat. Ooh, another gill bug. I can, so, I can trade those with someone? I can give them to somebody? Okay, this might be, the, oh, cutscene? Never mind. I was gonna say this is where we call it, but, hmm. Oh, Sid! Sid. Ah, oh, Clive. You're not where I left you. Nah. Hurt your hand. How do you Oh. With a thousand little lightning bolts. Can't throw them around the way I used to. I don't like the look of this. I don't like the look of that. I just Into saw those eyes. bearers down there. Long service and exemplary misconduct. Mm. I'm nervous. I'm worried about Sid. But you didn't come here to compare war wounds. We didn't. Thank you, Sid. For everything. <clears throat> if you want to leave, that's your lookout. I'm sure you'll have a long and happy life together if you stay out of my way. 
uh, together, eh? <laughs> Fucking goots. I knew a girl back in the day. She was a slave to her fate, just like you. Benedicta? I wanted to save her. For a while, I even thought I could. But just because you think something doesn't make it true. Sid. I'm no saviour. Just a conceited old fool. I talk about people forging their own futures. But instead of handing them the hammer, I beat them with my own. And if no bugger wants to listen to what you've got to say, you might as well keep your gob shut. But Clive, I will say this. You're not a monster. You're the same man you've always been. Thank you, Except sir. That, and you may yet escape your fate. My fate. Look, lad, you've had a hard life. And I don't see it getting much easier. You might not be able to save anyone else. But at the very least, you can save yourself. Sorry we didn't get a chance to talk, but I trust you'll take good care of the boy. Yes, I will. Is that the last of it? Aye. We'd best head back then. Wouldn't want to keep Nan waiting. Ta-ra then. Oh my god, ta-ra. My old best friend growing up was very British, her mom especially, and she'd say Tara. Oh my god. Alrighty. And Rubio is good? Okay, I'll call you Rubio. Sorry, my bad. Thanks for the explanation. I didn't know that. No worries. Now you know. Yeah, I definitely recommend trying a Final Fantasy game. I mean, again, I've only played Final Fantasy 14, I've only played Final Fantasy 16, but I am thoroughly enjoying both of them. And I've heard wonderful things about pretty much every other FF game. I mean, they're 16 for a reason, right? <laughs> As for the flames, hello! Minho, hello! I, I try to be normal, but then Sid appears and I just want to climb him like a tree. Yeah. I hear the levy. I I can relate to that. I try to remain normal and calm, and then I see Clive, and I see Sid, and I see Benedicta, and I lose my mind. And now Dino or whatever his name is. Oh. Martha said the blight had spread even further south. I'm all right, Flames. I'm all right. It's a little bit on the tired side, and my body is kind of hurting a little bit, but I'm hanging in there. Doing the best that I can, given the circumstances of my body aching. Well, I may have to hop off. To hop, I may have to hop off later, a lot sooner than I'd hoped. Really wanted to keep playing tonight, but if my body can't keep up, then you know I don't want to strain myself. They're also hot, and for what? I know, right? Book pad. Yo. Nice what the fuck are you going? Going to jail? Nah. Ooh. The way Jill and I both just dove into him, that was sick! Oh, relationship goals, truly. Amazing, amazing. So fucking cool. 
should play Final Fantasy 13 Lightning Returns. Wait, okay. So one of my friends really loves the Lightning games and actually gifted them to me, I'm pretty sure. Let me see, let me open Steam. Time to go smoke a joint, I'll be back. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, enjoy your bud. Okay, it seems like Steam doesn't want to open. Okay, it's opening. Let's see. Okay, I have Final Fantasy X I I I and Final Fantasy X I I I too. So those, I'm assuming, are both of the lightning games? Oh, there's a press over there. Oh, shit. That's enough. Oh, Red, hello! What's up, Red? How are you? I didn't know you were in here. But I do like how the primers work in this game. They pull small enemies off you so you focus the big enemies. Yeah, it actually is nice. The the AI is uh, actually useful, which I find to be quite rare. Go to add this as a command for the, for this game. Hey, baby, never looks so good. He says, "Ooh, give us back our man." What? What? Kelsey, what is that? Just read lightning games. Only the first two are good. Oh, there are three. Should I add those to my list? I mean, I already own two of them. Excuse me, I'll use that blade of yours. Curse my luck, a brand. Wait, that's the slumber good. I am one she of those. Me tried, but you want me to kill wolves? Me. All right. All right. It worked. I, I must go. I uh, no, sorry, Red. Right. You're stuck here now. I, I Until I'm ready to go. Blazer, hello. How are you? Speak to my friend over the bridge. That's true, I don't have to babysit their HP cheery, which is really, really nice. I don't- Okay, so I do love micromanaging- Sorry, I thought I saw a spider. I do really enjoy micromanaging in video games. I love having to, like, go crazy over a party and make sure everyone is staying alive. But it can be very frustrating, uh, depending on, um, on, like, the game's mechanics. For example, this one. Like, I can't play as the other- God fucking damn it. I can't play as the other, um, as like my party members, so it's kind of like redundant. Or it would be redundant to do that. Okay, I actually did not want to use that on that. That's fine. Oh, extra. Wait! God, I love fighting with my dog. Gotta find this Bryce and let him know the road's safe. All right, let's go to Bryce. Yeah, it's all on the way. Perfect. The most basic of all RPG quests. Here, hero, go here and bring me twelve bear asses. Literally. Oh my God, Fletchling hero, can you help me with this really Bryce, tough, insane quest? Yes, thank you. Bearer. I'll give you a hundred G for it. Love me, believe a signal again if you. Thick. And I got my thousand, my thousand gil, yeah? Beauty. Beauty, babes. Beauty. <laughs> Final Fantasy VII Remake has a neat balance. You can switch between the party members or just give them commands. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Aren't most of the Final Fantasy games, like, turn-based? The Windmills. That must be Eastfall. I don't like turn-based games. <laughs> I really don't. I mean, like, I, I don't mind them, but... Back to... Ooh, apartment hunting! Where are you looking for apartments in? I am kind of getting deja vu here. Liberty Village? Toronto's Liberty Village?! No, right? What? 
Dude, do not get a place in Liberty Village. D Are you moving here? Did you get accepted? Did Canada take you? Quite. Do not get a place in Liberty Village. Do not. I mean, Liberty Village is not that bad, but do not. If you're going to be driving around... You. You're Clive Rossfield. <gasps> yes, I am. It's me. It's me, Hannah. Rodney Murdoch's wife. Oh, shit. Lady Hannah. Oh, I knew it was you. You haven't changed at all. And Lord Marquis and Jill, too. It's so good to see you both again. <gasps> oh, goodness. It's good to see you, too, Lady Hannah. Me too, girl. If you have time, you simply must come back to the house. I haven't much to offer, but what is mine is yours. We should be delighted. Am I gonna get cookies? She can't feed me cookies. <laughs> and you have been wandering the world ever since. I can well understand fleeing from those iron blood brutes. But oh. I'm sorry. How am I supposed age? to look at Clive and not have my heart beat out of my chest? I wish his eyes back. were brown. I would it's pass away. I well, would Lady simply Hannah. pass away. Do you think you will stay here in Eastpool? Rosaleth still enjoys the Mother Crystal's blessing, is it not? You I love Jill's me. voice. Whoever the voice actress is, she's this house holds a lot of such a, for me. a delicate. So long as I can live here in peace. Not like airy voice, but a very like. Not that it matters. I don't know how the to describe it, but it's. I love Duchess. it. Pleasing. Or should I say, her Imperial Majesty. Annabella's marriage to the Emperor of Sambrec heralded a great many changes here. Yes. Of course. Oh, forgive me. I... I didn't mean to... Oh. Please. There is nothing to forgive. Would my mother not make an exception for you and your husband? Surely she would not refuse the Lord Commander. You haven't heard, then. Rodney passed away on the night of the fire. He never returned from Phoenix Gate. I... I'm sorry. Clive. My poor child. You look pale. All this traveling must have taken its toll. I insist you rest. We can talk later. You... All the baggage that Clive is carrying must literally be tearing him apart. You can just see it. You can hear it weighing him down. Are you sure I just... you don't want to sleep inside? Mm. I can't. Not after what I did. Lady Hannah said she would prepare a change of clothes for you in the morning. She really has been very kind. Oh, 
Oh, this is like the night when they were like staring at the sky together, but this is like sad. Oh! Oh. Without the faintest glimmer of hope. Oh. It was only Joshua that kept me going. I swore that I would avenge his death. That I would kill his killer. That was the only thing that gave my life any meaning. But if it was me who killed Joshua and Murdoch and all the others, then why the hell am I still breathing? I ask myself the same. When I fought, hundreds died. There were so many bodies, so many lives cut short from their crime. That day in Dalmechia, I... I wanted to join them. I wanted it all to end. I couldn't bear it anymore. Bonding over... <laughs> being suicidal trauma trauma bonding <laughs> me too girl me too besties i'm sorry you remember that night on the balcony <laughs> yes i do that's what i You came back to me. The heavens must have a plan for us. Oh, 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 We should get some rest. Right. <laughs> like Elwyn did when he was your age. Wait, let me see. Let me How see. Did you come to have some of my father's old clothes? Well, before Elwyn became Look at his Duke, fucking breasts! Families would often summer together. Bro, he is he snatched! These clothes have been in a wardrobe for years, collecting cobwebs along with everything else. Sorry for depriving you of your memories. I'm just, uh, it's, cool. mm. it's what your father would have wanted. That is a cinched, teeny tiny little waist. And for what? I just want to grab him and just, whoop! Oh my it's god. Well. Uh -huh. <laughs> you like the view? You like the sights? Thank you, Lady Hannah. Mm. Thank you indeed, Lady Hannah. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. You are doing my eyes a service. It may only have been for a short while. But seeing you again took me back to happier times. Seeing him also takes me to very happy times too. Especially when he's looking like that. Fare you well. Mm. My lord and lady. Mm. And you. Mm. Lady Hannah. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 All that chest and for what? It's not looking practical, bestie, but I'm digging it. Look, the whole, the whole, the whole fit. The whole fit, the whole fit, the fit is fitting. His thighs are so thick. Look at that. <laughs> now, why did they?
Look. I just want to know why I don't even know how to uh, mm. the the leather the 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 leather is um <laughs> the way the light is hitting that leathered package is marvelous <laughs> Um, okay. <laughs> I cannot. This is so slutty. Look at his look at his fucking titties. Look the the his his sides are literally singed. They are literally singed. And for what? Oh my god, Clive, you little slut. Ah! His leather is so swishy! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Wait, did all of my... Did all of my stuff get... Get boosted? Oh, it did. Got anything else for me? Well, it should make me a few gill. See Amazing. you then. Compliments to his tailor, indeed. Every fic I've seen mentions the size of that thing! <laughs> I'm taking notes, I'm taking notes. Did you just sell your new gear? No, I'm wearing the new gear. Did I sell it? No, I'm wearing it. See? I know what I'm doing. I look so... I look so good. Wait, chat. These bangs were such a good idea. I look so cute in my little Pedro Pascal shirt. <laughs> the bangs were such a good idea. Look at them. <laughs> uh, let me catch up with chat. Sorry. Let me see. Let me see. Let me go back to what uh, Red was saying. Oh, City Street, hey, what's up? I don't know, did we accept Red? Wait! Oh my god, wait, Red, did you- Wait, did you actually- Are you actually- Did you actually get accepted to work in- in- in Canada? Like, you're working on your visa stuff right now, but like, it, it's- it's a thing that's happening? Okay, I'm telling you right now, Liberty Village is nice, it does have a lot of dogs, but it is not a fun place to live. I had this conversation the other day with somebody else. Like, it is, a, it, it, it's not bad, but, like, you could do better. You could do so much better. Um, I would say even, like, closer to the distillery would be, would be, would be good for you. There are dogs everywhere in the city. Like, regardless, you're peachy. The way Clive's face lit up seeing Hannah, she must have been, like, the mother he never had since Rodney was the guy who taught Clive how to sword fight. Considering, um, Clive didn't have a mother, basically, yeah. That's the vibe that I got, too. Mm. If you're taking transit, you will need to take extra travel time into account. True, yeah, tra uh, transit in the city is kind of a nightmare right now. You are going, like, you're gonna have to do a lot of, like, combo, like, walking and transit, so you have to take that into consideration. Look up Vincent Follow Clive Cosplay. He's Clive's German VA. I'm looking very Latina. Thank you. 
Like Selena? Okay, yeah, I've, I was told that. Oh shit, this is so good! The hair is so insanely big! God, I really want to cosplay Clive. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do it. I need to. I need to. I'm good, Mercy. How are you? I will die if you do. Do it. I will. I mean, y'all have... I've, I've shown you it before, but y'all have seen my, my Trevor Belmont, right? I never got around to finishing my Trevor, but it's roughly like the same thing. You know? Well, not like the same thing, but the same like essence, right? Like... The messy hair, which will be, I will, I'll, I could do a wig, but now that I have bangs, I can like, I can like really like gel this up and like go all like, shoo, 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 you know? Um, yeah. I think I could fucking, I could fucking kill it. I'd do a fucking great Clive cosplay. Okay. Oh, let's see. We are at the four hour mark. Okay. I was gonna say. So our our witness. By the flame. You're his firstborn. Clive Rosfield. That's You're mistaken. It. Oh, you can't fool me, my lord. You're the very image of your father. And that would be true even if you weren't wearing his clothes. The self-same garments Hannah was keeping for you, if I'm not mistaken. She always swore that she would never part with them. Until the day Elwyn's sons returned. And now that day has come. <laughs> Why, you'll be able to take your bearers back as well. My bearers. Forgive me, Master Mayor. I was a child when last I came to Eastbourne. I didn't recognize you. Oh, I'd be surprised if you recognized anything at all. Much has changed since Rosaria fell to the Empire. Not least for the bearers who once served her noble families. When the Iron Blood sacked Rosalind 13 years back, Many who lost their masters fled here, in search of sanctuary. And never returned. Aye. The plan was to send them home once we'd won back the capital. But then the Imperials arrived. Rosaria became a province of San Breck. The duchy was dissolved, and they no longer had any home to return to. Back in your father's day, any bearer who lost their master became a ward of the duchy. We'd hand them over to the sheriffs, and they'd be assigned a new position. But when we saw how the Empire treated their branded, we knew that wasn't an option. So they've been here ever since. And now you want to give them to me? They're yours by right. Lord Rosfield. Now can we ship them off to father. Hideaway? And they'd be better off serving you than hiding here. Indeed, many of them used to serve your house and still consider the Rosfields their masters. I'm no one's master. Not anymore. They wouldn't be safe with me. I can't stop looking at Clive's tiny I waist. understand. You'll forgive an old man his fanciful notions. Been daydreaming for too long. But still, I would ask a favor of you. A small mercy. If it is within my power. One of the bearers is an elderly fellow who still swears absolute loyalty to Archduke Elwyn. I don't ask that you take him into your service. Only Fame that visit. you meet with him. Mm. Let him see that Elwyn's son still lives, and that he's as fine a man as his father ever was. It would be my honor. 
Thank you, my lord. The slutty little you fucking like. Well, most days, watching the people go about their business. <laughs> if you could show him your face, he would be most grateful. The hip hop little. He is shaped like a Dorito. Clive has the Captain America body. He's literally shaped like a fucking Dorito. You're not so very different, you know. Especially dressed like that. Come on. Let's go and meet that bearer. What do you mean by that? You saying my dad was slutty? You saying me and my dad dressed slutty? What do you mean by that? God, look at his tits. Oh my god, Clive. I cannot, I cannot look at this. Here. Well, I can't leave without meeting him. I've let the mayor down once already. It will be cruel to disappoint him again. Right, let's ask around. Someone must have seen him. He's gotta cover those fucking titties up. Well now, unfamiliar faces. What brings you to Eastfall, travelers? We're looking for an elderly bearer. You wouldn't happen to have seen him, would you? Ah, you mean the old boy who always waits by the well? Yes, that's him. What, uh, what business do you have with him, if you don't mm. mind me asking? Why is You're she so suspicious? You're not from the capital too, are you? We are, in a way. Well then, it's a pleasure to meet a fellow Rosalithian. I was born in Rosalithian. I never would have left if Archduke Elwyn had survived the fire. It wasn't the same when the Duchess took over, though. All the beatings, the evictions. A bitch. The levies going up and up and up. I can't wait to take her down. Harvest. Assuming that I'll get the chance to. Oh, listen to me. Telling you what you already know. I'm sorry. I'm afraid I can't help you with your bearer either. Though I doubt he'll have gone far. He comes here every day. Almost as if he's waiting for something. Waiting for me? We'll keep asking around then. Thank you. Looks so cute today? Thank you. Thank you. To whom do I lie? You're always cute? Thank you. That's very sweet of you to say. There's a lot of funny fan art of Jill being as hilariously damned by for Clive as the fan base is. Truth is, we cannot possibly have her level of self control. That is a fact. She is very composed. She is looking, she's dusting off her boots when I am here dressed like a whore. Like, I, I would pounce. I would fucking pounce. Because I, I too am a whore. <laughs> I'm looking for a bearer. An elderly fellow who used to serve the Rosfields. Have you seen him? Ah, <clears throat> that old loon. No, no sign of him today. That old loon, yeah? He's usually down by the well at this hour. Cooking up his fantasy feasts. Fantasy I'm feasts. sorry. Oh. He worked in the kitchens at Rosalith Castle back Aww. in the day. Still thinks he's there now. Aww. They're often here at the Paul Fool. Oh my god, is he gonna to see Archduke. Clive and think it's Elwyn? Living in a dream he is. Oh, oh, chat. Here, I suppose. Can't imagine the vice regent stopping to try Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be bearer. able to, to sit you? through that. No. Oh. Anyway, he'll be around here somewhere. Doubt he has the path to stray too far. Thank you. We'll keep looking. Does Toronto have any good Mexican food? Absolutely. Hey, hold on a mo. Young Patrick, the chocobo keeper, might know where he is. Young Patrick. He's taking the old bird under his wing, so to speak. There's Gus's He'll tacos, be I believe it's called in Kensington, them, which is apparently very Patrick good. Patrick, the chocobo keeper. Thank you. We will. Sorry, Jill. For making you do all this in my stead. It can't be helped if we're to keep up the pretense. Come on, Fair. let's head for the stables. Oh, I love them. I ship them. I ship them. Hmm, where the bloody hell's he got to? Looking for the old man, too? Excuse me, but is something the matter? It's this bearer I've been minding. I take my mm. eyes off him for one minute and it's he probably disappears. the same man. He's not in his usual spot by mm. the well nor anywhere else in the village. 
You must be Patrick. I am, but... And this bearer you're looking for, he's an elderly man who used to work in the Rosalith Castle kitchens, yes? <gasps> That's Sorry. a fella. How do you know all this? I've never seen you in Eastpool before, but you seem to know the place better than I do myself. I just talk to people. And she's telling him the tea? Feeling the tea? Your mom lives in Toronto? Hey, it's me. I'm your mom. Ah, so that's how it is. Well then, if you're acting under orders of the mayor, you're on a bound to help me find him. He's been mm. losing what little sense he had left of late, saying the sheriffs are coming to collect him and that he needs to go back to the castle. Mm. I was supposed to watch over him, keep him out of trouble. But if he's walked out on us, there's not a lot I can do. Understood. You keep searching here. We'll look for him outside. Thank you. I'm in your debt. I'm nervous about what I'm going to find when I find him. Do you know what I mean? I hope he hasn't wandered into trouble. But yeah, that's exactly Let's just my concentrate fear. concentrate on finding him. Boop. 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 <gasps> Beep. Boop. I'm glad I'm not the only one who makes Clive skip, her, skip through towns when running from objective to objective. It's fun! Beep. Up. Oh. Beep. Boop. Straight even further. You do a gallop. You do a hop. You do a gallop. You do a hop. Okay. Oh, I'm pretty far. Oh, I'm pretty deep in here. Into the fucking thick of it, eh? I do love how like when you're when you're running eventually you p you pick off in a sprint. There's someone over there. Was that him? It might be him. We should hurry. Company. Oh, that's Company easy. The old man. They need to die. Agreed. They do need to die. Very true. Mm, can I even reach them with that? No. Give them all you've got, boys. Ooh, little fucking ice shield. Okay, I see you, girl. More? Oh, hello. Oh, it's not up. Scene time. Presumably, I was right. Are you all right, my friend? Come on, let's go home. Your Grace, you came for me. I waited for you so long, and you finally came. I'm not who you think, Clive. Pretend. Yes. Pray forgive my long delay. It's nothing, Your Grace. I prayed to the founder that you would come, and at long last, he answered. Will we be returning to the castle then? There is still a place for me in the kitchens? No, my friend. We will not be returning to the castle, not yet. I'm on a very important expedition, one which may take some time. Could you wait for me in Eastpool until my journey is complete? I will come back for you then. I promise. Of course, Your Grace. For you, I would gladly wait until my dying day.
Thank you. Both I am of you. unwell. You've been most kind. The memory of serving the late Archduke was his one light in the darkness. And now that light burns a little more brightly. I am unwell. It's nothing but a fantasy, of course. But it's better than the truth of the matter. A damn sight better. The blight is on our doorstep. Our harvests are failing. The people are leaving in droves. See, that's the shit that gets me. <laughs> if it weren't for Lady Hannah Old selling people. out her worldly goods to provide and for the dogs. robots who stayed behind, we and would the R2 button. starved. We want to keep the bearers safe here, we really do. But unless a miracle happens, we won't be able to spare a crust of bread to share between them soon enough. Is it really that bad? So bad, I even petitioned the Imperial Garrison to take them. But when they found out where they'd come from, they damn near spat in our faces. Ducal dogs, they called them. Enemies of the Empire. I know a man named Sid, who would gladly give a home to any bearer in need of one. <laughs> Leave this with me. As soon as I return from Phoenix Gate, I'll speak with him. Thank you, my lord. Yes! This is what I when wanted! You passing through Eastpool on your way back, I should very much like to speak with you again, if you have the time, regarding the future of the village, and what might be done for Lady Hannah. After all, she's done for us. Yes, of course. I'll be back anon. Fare you well, my lord, my lady. I wish you a safe journey. Quest complete. That was good. I enjoyed that. I liked that chapter a lot. That was really good. Good night, Rubio. Take care. Have you ever played that game where you press R2 and it resists, but when you press it all the way, an old person riding a dog pops out? What? I don't know what you're talking about. Toxifixel, hello. I think you were the 100 bits. Hope you're doing good today. Today, I can't stay for long. Good luck and have fun. Can't wait for Final Fantasy 14 to come to PC. You mean Final Fantasy 16? <laughs> Final Fantasy 14 is on PC. Oh man, does that count? Is that cry counter number two? Did I say 14? You did. <laughs> okay, we're at we're at two tiers. We've cried for the R2 button, and we've cried for the old man who has mistaken Clive for Archduke Elwyn. Oh, oh, good old dementia. I finally resorted to just typing FF16. I know, every time I put the XVI, I'm like, ha ah! Okay, chat. That is gonna be it for me. I really want to keep playing, but my back is really hurting me. I think I need to just relax for the rest of the night. But I had a ton of fun. It was so much fun playing today. And I cannot wait to see what's in store for the rest of the story tomorrow. The fucking fights in this game are actually like amazing. I didn't think I would enjoy them as much as I am, honestly. Um, but yeah, that's gonna be it for me. I started playing this game too. I like the boss fights. The boss fights are a lot of fun, right? I'm really, 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 really enjoying them. I hope you're having a good night, basic science tutor. But yes, yes, that is going to be it for me. I still have to figure out my mic situation. Dentist bought me the um the the mic arm thing i may just have to keep streaming like this for a while until it arrives which is gonna be like super annoying but i mean beggars can't be choosers right it is what it is vibes it is what it is all right let's see who are we going to raid we're gonna raid Jahara. I did not realize that she was live. Let's go see her. She's playing Final Fantasy, whatever number VI is. Good night, friends. I will see you in her stream, and I will see you in the Discord server and on social media. Don't forget to follow.
follow me everywhere that we can stay up to date with all my shenanigans and if you're in the server you'll get notified for when i go live i should be live tomorrow at i want to say 5 or 6 p.m it's not going to be a very long stream i am going out tomorrow um so unfortunate but that's okay that's fine gonna still cram in some game time and on monday i'll be back with a nice long stream because we will be starting tears of the kingdom for the first time very excited i don't know what i'm gonna i don't know what to expect going in there so that's gonna be fun but anyway yeah bye friends take care have a good night love you babes i love you good night Raid from Syra? Hello, Raiders! Hi, Syra! Welcome in! I hope y'all are doing well! I'm Jahara. Nice to meet you. I play Final Fantasy. And